original. All right, all that's fine. Yeah, remastered mode is gonna be off. That's how you make the game easier. And thank you very much, Coffee, for the watch streak. And thank you, Kane, for the watch streak. Coffee with 10, Kane with seven. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Art the Pie King, welcome in. Playing second best Zelda? Yeah, it's probably almost as good as Zelda 2. I know, right? Almost. Let's start a new game. Let's start a new game and see how it goes. Vanessa, I miss it. How far did you make it today? This will be some stream. I've been looking forward to playing this for a while. I know, I'm weird. I get it. Vanessa, how far did you make it in Mystic Quest today? I want to know. I like that game. I like most people. Ooh, that game stuck. No, I like it. That's one of my childhood games. Wizard of Oz is worse. We'll see. Durple Ganger, welcome in. How's it going? I wonder how faithful the off remaster is playing in the actual hardware. We'll find out. New game! New game, yes! It's, it's time. Duke Ankhled is under attack by the evil forces of Ganon. I'm going to Gamelon to aid him. But father, what if something happens to you? I'll take the Triforce of Courage to protect me. If you don't hear from me in a month, send Link. Ampa! Don't worry, Zelda. The Triforce of Wisdom promises the king will safely return. Enough. My ship sails in the morning. I wonder what's for dinner. Oh boy, I'm so hungry, I could eat an Octorok. <sighs> A whole month gone, and still no word. I'm certain he's all right. Yeah, that old Ganon's no match for the king. Link, go to Gamelon and find my father. Great, I can't wait to bomb some Dodongos. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up, Impa. We're going to Gamelon. All right, dear. I'll get the Triforce of Wisdom. <laughs> it's way worse than I thought it would be. Holy shit. <laughs> I was trying not to laugh. <laughs> Oh my God, all right. That is unbelievable. And that's my first thought right there is how unbelievable that is. All right, I'm trying to make sure the sound is decent so you guys can hear everything properly. Oh my God. All right, dear, I'll just go pack up the Triforce like I'm packing a lunch. <laughs> oh my God, all right, well. Can't wait to bomb some the dongos and eat Nocta Rocks. What the hell are we getting into? Holy shit. Unbelievable. Jukebox. This is going to be really fun. <laughs> it's way cornier than I ever thought it would be. My God. I've never watched a playthrough of this, so I don't know how it's going to go other than that. So, yeah. Sarvin, what's going on? Welcome in. Good to see you, man. Hope you're having a great day. Trick me. What's going on? I wonder what's for dinner, too. <laughs> oh, my God. It's going to be insane. Hacksaw, what's up, man? Welcome in. All right. Uh, I read in the manual, you can, like, this is how you choose where you go. So you, you like, okay, so we can go to Kubiton, Sakado, and this is... Aru Ainu, I guess we could go to those places. Can we go here? No. All right, so you know what? This is how Hyrule Field should have worked in Ocarina. You just pick where you want to go. You don't have to walk across a big empty field. So already one up for this game over Ocarina on based on where you're going. <laughs> how about that? Norad, how's it going today? Welcome in. Nice to see you always. I can't believe you've been with me. You're one of the very first people that found my stream. Unbelievable. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Good to see you. This is a PC remake of Zelda CDIS. It's got the same game. I turned off all the extra crap. Was it paying attention to the story or anything? I'm sure you weren't, Link. I'm sure you... Neither was I. Neither was I. I don't know where to go. Aru Ainu? I don't know. Let's go. Oh, now we're playing. Okay. All right, how do the controls work? All right, button one jumps. All right, button two uses sword. All right, that doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. See, it plays like Zelda 2, which I was thinking I might like that. 
Alright, so how do you go down? What's this do? Okay, that goes back out to the map. So you, you guys are gonna have to bear with me here. I have no idea what I'm doing at all. None whatsoever. Rage Time Gaming, thank you for the resub for two years. With Twitch Prime, I appreciate it. Someone on the Alf stream said you were looking for subs. Thought I'd pop out and hit the subscribe button. No, I'm not looking for subs. I'm just saying that people, uh, instead of like gift subs or bits, subbing would help me a lot more towards getting Partner Plus. I'm actually kind of close to it. So that's why I brought that up, but I appreciate it very much for the 24 months, sir. That is really, really, really kind. Thank you. Old Man Markle, welcome in as well. Good to see you. We, uh, you'll play Wand of Gamblon, but not Ocarina. That's right. That's right, Lord Malachi, because this game, I think, is actually going to be fun for me, whereas Ocarina of Time, I would fall asleep in the first 10 minutes out of sheer boredom. But I don't think I'm going to get bored here. Could you get bored with memes like this? All right, you know what? This actually does not control terribly. How do you bring up the menu? That's in the manual. Hold up. Let me pull the manual up. I can't even figure out how to get... Oh, there. How did I do that? How do you do that? Wait, what? I saw the menu for a second. Oh, wait, what's this? Impa's wisdom. Lubanga is quite brave, refusing to leave her home and knitting behind. Sadly, her house key was stolen by a foul horn creature. Once you can see her, perhaps she can fashion something for you to wrap up nasties with lots of wrappings. Okay, is that, oh, that's like a, okay, that's like a clue or something? All right, well, that's what happens when you hit select. Okay, how do you go into buildings? Oh my god, do you know how you, oh my god, oh, you go, you don't press up to go in the building, you, you press the X button. <laughs> you press a button to go in the building. What the hell, okay. I still not, let me, oh shit, okay, hold up, hold up, hold everything. I still know how to get in the menu. Let me get the manual, I read the manual last night. You have to press a button to go in the building, hold up. I need to check something. All right, here's the manual. At least I think it's not. Come on, Google, Jesus Christ, are you are you gonna work? Yes, you are. Okay, here we go. Here's the manual. So this is what I'm gonna be looking at. I'm not looking at a guide or game facts. I'm looking at this. Or somebody goes, hey, Major, you're looking up solutions for the game. No, I'm not. I am not. You really think you're going to enjoy this game? Retro Junkie, welcome in, sir. I think I will. <laughs> I think I'm going to like it. Uh, it's very meme -y and kind of silly looking so far, but you know what? I, I kind of like off-the-wall games occasionally. Rydia, welcome in. How's it going? Good to see you. Good to see Retro Junkie. You're going to have a good time laughing, right? Yeah, of course you are. He has some jank Zelda going on today. Absolutely. Oh, good to see you, old man Markle. Glad to be able to drop that six months in advance on you yesterday. Sagan, thank you for the resub yesterday. I saw that in the log yesterday, and I meant to say something, but thank you very much. Sub when I'm here, so that way I can thank you for it. Zelda gets her own game, and look what happened. Yeah, Zelda doesn't know what's going on here. Yeah, it's got quality of life changes, as Grunt said. Absolutely. Makes her cheating on the down low, and I approve. I, I never cheat. I'm trying to figure out how to open the menu. It doesn't make sense. Where do you open the menu? I did it once by accident. Okay, here it is. Button one, swing sword. Crouch down, blah, blah, blah. Open or close magic palace. Crouch down and press button two. Are you telling me you can't open the menu without crouching down? Dude, you have to hold down. You can only look at the menu when you're holding down. What in the absolute shit? Okay, I've never seen that in any game before. Oh, and by the way, to go in the building, you have to hit the same button. Oh, so if you want to hit the... Uh... <laughs> you can't look at the menu if you're in front of a door because it's the same button. It's the same button to pull the menu up as it is to go in and out of the door. So I can't look at the menu and go through the door at the same time. That is unbelievable. All right, Unbreakable Pixel, welcome in. How's it going today? CD, I only had two buttons, yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> it's still hard even with like a modern controller. Fool's license, welcome in. This is not your favorite Zelda. It's better knock arena already. At least I'm uh, not bored. What the hell is this? A, it's like a freaking Stegosaurus or something. <laughs> Okay, can you not kill this? I guess you can't kill this. Oh, you, a what? Oh, you could, okay, good. All right, now how the hell do you get out of here? I can't, you can't tell what you can jump on in this game. Look, every, that looks like that's in the background. You, you can barely see what you can jump on. <laughs> Dude, this game is insane. Retro Frito, welcome in. How's it going today? This game won't be boring. That's all I care about is if it's going to be, is it going to be boring or not? If it's not, I'm going to find a way to like it. What the hell is this? Okay, how do you talk to people? Hey, that doesn't do anything. Up doesn't do anything. Down doesn't do anything. Everyone ran when the Gleok came, but monsters know better than bothering me. Here's a shroud that scares the raps off Gibdo. Okay. You, you, hey guys, guess how you talk to people? You stab them! Everyone ran into the <laughs> You actually attack the people to talk to them! Oh my god! <laughs> we got a uh, emphasis now you've explored this place the best of your ability, dearie. Alright. We brought the Triforce of Wisdom with us or something. All right, so how do I use this new item? I'm trying to go to the inventory and she keeps going through the door. All right, here's this new item, Shroud. How do you make this work? Oh shit, okay, good. All right, so now I have a ranged weapon. I thought this was Wait, she's throwing the cloak at people? She's throwing the cloak at people. Lord Malachite, I turned off the quality of life improvements. You want to see that? Once I get back to the map in a minute, I turned off all quality of life improvements. There's a way to do that, and you get the original experience. So that's what I did. Wolfmaster, welcome in. How's it going today? Hope you're having a good day. Hey, I'm having fun with a Zelda game. Look. It's like the opposite of a cloak, and she throws it at people. What the hell is this? All right, I have a range attack now. I shouldn't be complaining. All right, except it sucks. It doesn't do anything. Oh, it doesn't even hit enemies? Okay, this is like the worst range attack. But it doesn't do any damage. <laughs> it doesn't do shit. All right, maybe it will at some point. All right, now what do you do here now? Okay, this goes back to the map. Okay, here we go. Oh, it opened this up. Now we can go to Taikogi Tower. We can go to Sakato. Kob Kobitan. Okay, so maybe you complete areas that opens up more of the map. I don't know. It, it kind of hinted at that the manual. I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. All right. Still plays different. You're getting a much better frame rate. All right, here's where you can do that. Okay, so you go to options, and it says remastered mode off that's where it adds a bunch of quality of life crap i have that turned off so we get the original experience so i don't know exactly what that would add there was like a list of stuff where you could actually uh see that when i downloaded the game but i didn't even read it because i was like we're going to turn that off because i want to play the original style version i think that would be more fun don't you don't don't you guys think we need to save the game by the way i haven't saved yet so i don't want to lose any progress all right, save one, two, or three, one, I guess. All right, continue on. No life, what is going on? How did James Bond Jr. go last night? How did, uh, did you make some more progress on that? It's got like a loop too, all right? The music actually sounds good, Radio. Right? Yeah, it sounds really good. How did the progress go last night, No Life? That looks like a fun game. I've got that on my list. I've been trying not to spoil it. I've been peeking in every now and then. I know you've been working on it, but dude. I kind of want to try that. It looks like it looks like a finish it up starting Bucky O'Hare. Okay, good. Bucky O'Hare is really. I think you're gonna enjoy that one. I really like that game. You'll beat that in like no time. <laughs> it's not an easy game, but like for you, just breeze right through it. It won't be a problem. Very nice. Thank you for the hundred bits as well, dude. 
Yeah, Bucky O'Hare is fun. I think uh, it, it, most people that play that game seem to enjoy it. I'm Goten, I remember you saying you didn't really like Bucky O'Hare at one point. Uh, Janice, what's going on? So happy CDI games exist. Me too. You know what? This is better than Ocarina. I just said it. Where the hell do we go now? I have no idea where to go now. None whatsoever. <laughs> I guess we'll just... I think that's a Tobiton, Sakato. I don't know. I have no idea. Hold on. Let me, I'm going to pull the manual up on my screen so I can actually like keep an eye on like things in case I forget what's going on here. I really want the manual available. All right. Now I have the manual pulled up on the side of the screen. Someone chose violence when they woke up this morning. Well, who? Me? Never me. Violence. Who do you think I am? Oh, a guy from Red Bank, what's going on? How's it going today? Bucky O'Hare's a fun one. It absolutely is. It is a good one. That was, it's a Konami run and gun. I mean, what more could you want? It's, it's fine. Makes more sense, actually. Link's always stealing, ransacking houses, but never arrested. This one's Zelda's murdering witnesses before. And I know, I like that. You stab the people to get them to talk. That's hilarious. Hilarious. Oh, you're Alf? Then I should ban you straight up. I should just absolutely ban you straight up for that. I'll just pretend you're not here. Better than Ocarina? Yeah, yeah Janice, it is. Deal with it. <laughs> Where are we going? I don't know. Let's go here. Oh, there's the enemy. I thought this was a... Oh, shit. I thought there was like... This was going to be like a town. But there's enemies here. Okay, maybe we have to free the town. I don't know anything right now. Wait, what? You have to hit the rupees to pick them up! <laughs> oh my god, am I dead? I'm dead! Okay, I didn't even see my health bar. Okay, I continue. Alright, we're fine. <laughs> okay, you, you die really quickly. Sometimes the enemies are way more powerful here. Oh my god. Okay. Dude, you can't just touch a rupee to pick it up. You have to hit it. <laughs> what were they thinking with this? Alright. Did we kill everything? Do they respawn? Okay, it looks like we freed the town. Maybe they won't respawn now. I don't know. Okay, I can't go back. You can't leave! You don't die this fast in Ocarina, just saying. Well, you die fast in Contra. That doesn't make that game bad. At least I'm not, like I said, I'm not bored. <laughs> That's right, you're just wandering in a field. How could you die? There's no enemies. Deathless run ruined. <laughs> All right, what about over here? Oh, you that kills you if you go in the water. Okay, well, can't go. Oh, now all the enemies are going to respawn. Okay, great. Oh, right. All right, we're figuring it out. <laughs> wow, this is jank. All right, you know what? It's actually kind of fun at the same time. Trying to, like, figure out something you've never seen in your... Well, that went well. Okay, so I guess I ran out of lives. Where do you see how many lives you have? Is that on the status screen? Okay, I think that's this. The three hearts, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. Okay, I have that shroud weapon too. Hold up. Okay, this is like the biggest piece of shit ever. It doesn't hurt enemies. What is the point of that? All right, well, at least we're getting rupees. I guess I just try and go in the houses. <laughs> I really don't know what I'm doing here at all. And I'm dead again. Oh my god. <laughs> Does my shield block stuff or not? It doesn't appear to be doing anything. Can you not block? Maybe it's like Zelda 2. You have to like... Okay, it does. You can block stuff. Okay, good. But if you're moving, it doesn't work. Well, that's not like Zelda 2 at all. All right, never mind. That doesn't work very well. All right, at least I know I can block stuff. Zelda's is, yeah, I know. I'd choose 3D Zelda over this game. I wouldn't. This game's way better than Ocarina. <laughs> this is so much better than Ocarina. It's not even close. Neo, what's up? Jess, welcome in. How are you guys doing today? Don't worry about spoilers for this game because no one plays this shit. I play it. <laughs> what about me? What's that say? I play it. Doing this with same CDI through MAME? No, this is a downloadable uh, remake of this you can get online. This is not through MAME. This is not through RetroArch or any of that. 
Uh, but yeah, you can, anybody can download this game. You can play this on PC. Yes, you can, Guy from Red Bank. Absolutely. You can go download it and you can join in on the fun. Heelstone, welcome in. This is Zelda CDI. Welcome uh, to a game that's pretty jank so far, but it's also kind of interesting. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm making like no progress at all. Can you go in here? You can. Okay, good. Of course I'm on your side, but I still have to sell the stuff. Just pick what you want. I'll handle the rubies. Rubies? Rubies? Excuse me, sir. We're in Hyrule? I thought it was rupees. Rubies? How could they screw that up? Holy shit! Rubies! Oh my god! I can't get over that. <laughs> Rubies! <laughs> Is it the same same thing? Side, yes. Okay. But I still have to sell the stuff. All right. Shut up. We heard you. All right. So how do you buy stuff? Those are bombs. Oh, you hit the bombs with your sword and get them. Neat. Future rush. Welcome in. Holy crap, how you doing today? Gaijin, welcome in. Rubies! Smart and Tart, what's going on? Why download this and play when you get Ocarina Time instead? I mean, who dislikes Ocarina Time anyways? Yeah, who would dislike that game? You know anybody like that? I do. He's right here. Okay, can we buy all, we're, are we buying, oh wait, hold up. Impa's Wisdom, ah, Sakaito, the bustling port town. Wait, where is everyone? Oh dear, they are mon there are monsters. Worse, a foul Gibdo is taking up residency, residency in the church. He's shrouded in darkness, so maybe a shroud is the key to his unwrapping. Oh, so we can kill him with this. Okay, well, that's nice to know. All right, how do you go to your inventory? It's down in the X button. What the hell is that crap? All right, so here's bombs, here's rope, and that's... Is that in the manual? Hold up. Let me check the manual. I don't know what anything is. The manual says bombs, ropes, and lamp oil. Okay, it says most enemies fall when hit by a bomb or its fragment. You also find bombs used for blowing up obstacles to block the path. Merchant sells a uh, pack of three bombs for 20 rupees. Rope says use these for climbing. Their hooks sink into many wooden surfaces like tree limbs and flooring, but they can't penetrate most stone. Three packs of ropes cost 10 rupees. Ganon's evil is dark in many areas of Gamelon. Unless you find a lamp, you'll spend much of your quest wandering in the darkness. Once you have a lamp, you need a good supply of oil to keep it burning at five rupees for three po portions. Lamp oil is cheap. Some of the natives talk a magic lantern that burns without oil okay so uh we're getting some information from the manual here if you guys are wondering what i'm looking at no 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 not rubies rupees are not in the game rubies are what the hell is that i have no idea what what were they thinking i do not know i haven't a clue of course i'm on your but i don't want to talk to you all right can we buy more stuff i i can't figure out the inventory at all all right, I guess we'll get more bombs. I didn't want to go back outside. I'm trying to look at the... God, it's the same button, dude. That's going to be a big problem. All right, now we have bombs. Now, how many rubies do I have? 53. All right, ropes and oil is at three, but I can't use that yet because apparently it says you need a lantern or something. I don't know. All right, so what does this do? Okay, that goes... What in the hell? The only way to go back outside the town is to go through the shop. You can't just walk to the left and go back out. All right, that's really weird. I, I don't understand like anything that's going on here. Proto, what is going on? Welcome in, how's it going today? Lethal Bradley, hope you and Jess had a very nice Valentine's Day. Jess said what you guys did. You guys went to the store, went to the aisle where they sell Valentine's cards. You picked out cards you thought each other would like read them and then put them back on the shelf that is a incredibly wonderful idea and i love it <laughs> it's like the best valentine's uh, idea i've ever heard i'm gonna do that next year it's gonna be great think hard, think smarter not harder exactly genius work here <laughs> it's the first card i picked and it was so perfect the best part's not paying for them right proto how's it going today man <laughs> welcome in. this game is really jank but i'm enjoying it I know, I'm having fun trying to figure this out. I, it's a Zelda game, which means it's not going to be super easy to figure everything out. Oh, now I'm in the dark. All right, but oh, that's a Moblin. I know my Zelda enemies. I wonder if I should even be in here yet. <laughs> Probably not. Can I do anything in this room, or am I just going to die in here? I'm just going to die in here. Great, okay. 
I'm probably not supposed to be in here yet since I can't see. We'll go back out. Okay. No pro Oh, enemies respawn going in and out of the door. Maybe I could farm rupees that way. Guess we should keep that in mind. I'm going to write that down, actually. Because I think writing clues down is good. This is a town of Sakato. I'm sure there's going to be other towns and stuff. All right, so we can, we can get supplies here. I'm going to write that down. And we can farm rupees. I'm writing rupees down, by the way. I'm not fighting rupee, rubies. This game is wrong, but I'm gonna correct it. It's a goblin, not a moblin. Well, in this game, it probably is. You're right. This game's like goofing up all the Zelda lore. Locked, oh good, locked doors. And I have no, maybe there's a key around here somewhere. Lock, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even ready. All right. Proto, hope you're having a wonderful day, man. Looking forward to more Ghouls and Ghosts Challenge. That's going to be fun. I like that game a lot, but good God, that's hard for a one credit clear. I've never been able to do it on that one. I've got a one credit clear on NES Ghosts and Goblins and Super Ghouls and Ghosts, but not on the Genesis one yet. We can go in here. Oh, God, someone else to talk to. Holy shit. Hello, dearie. Oh, just a minute. Isn't it lovely? Bring some fairy dust and I'll make it a magic cloak. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't trust you! <laughs> Good God! <laughs> Okay, that was weird. All right, that was a little bit disturbing. She doesn't have feet. Yeah, I don't trust this person at all. Even did she say yes? Bring some fairy dust, and I'll make it a magic cloak. Look at those eyes. I don't trust that at all. Good, and don't get in my face again like that, Jesus. I did stab her. That's how you talk to people in this game. <laughs> Rush Pirate, welcome in! Good God, this game's full of one surprise after another. Is there anything in this house we can steal? Can we steal any? Oh, you can stand on this podium, which is actually in the background. Dude, you can jump on things that are in the background. Yes, she does not have feet. They they forgot to like add feet when they were creating the sprite. You know, oh, dude, dude, where am I now? You can go through the window. What is that? You can go through that window? Oh my god. All right, I'm gonna have to check like every window now. Oh great. All right, I've probably already missed stuff. I, I was, I didn't know you could do that. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so you're supposed to actually be able to go through stuff like that. Okay, you can't go through that, that painted window on the wall, but you can go through this one. Okay, so this is somewhere completely different now. <laughs> oh my god, this is jank. Okay. You can't go that way. All right, let's save it. <laughs> I wasn't sure if it would let me go that way. All right, apparently you can just die like almost anywhere. All right, let's save it. I've made, I bought some things, so we made a little progress there. Let's continue along. Fell Sorcerer, what is going on? Sorry, I don't know what's happening. Thank you for the 500 bits. I appreciate it, man. The best Zelda game, it is extremely jank. Extremely. I appreciate the bits very much, sir. Thank you very, very, very much. I don't deserve the level of kindness you guys bestow upon me, but thank you very, very much. I hope you're having a good day, man. Ocarina is way better, but I kind of like this game too. I like this game a lot more than Ocarina. I'm entertained by how janky this is. I don't. I, I'm a simple person apparently when it comes to entertainment. I'm having fun. <laughs> I'm actually having fun. Where the hell was that lady? She was in here. Nope, that's a locked door. I'm gonna write down there's a locked door in this town because we might have to come back to that later. I have no idea. But let's go ahead and write that down. There's a locked door. Because we'll probably find a key for it at some point or another. But right now, I'm just going to write that down. All right, let's go back in there. All right, do you say the same thing? Isn't it lovely? 
Shelby. Yeah, I don't need to see that again. We're good. Let's go. Okay, back to where we were. So I didn't lose any progress. I like that you play as Zelda as well. I'm with you. I'm a fan of playing as Zelda. This is like the first time it happens, right? I think. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong. I've only played early Zelda games. Uh, Goobs, what's going on, man? How you doing today? I hope you're having a good day, sir. Same for you, Coyote. Welcome in. I'm doing good. We're playing a good Zelda game. It's better than Ocarina of Time. I agree, Healer. I agree completely. 100% water kills you in Zelda 2, so that matches up. See? Uh, Zelda 2 had good ideas. I'm, I'm with that. I'm on board with it. Chris, what's going on? Sounds like never going to give you up. Well, that sounds fine to me. I'm fine with it. I'm giving you a hard time. This is pretty amazing. Hey, everybody gives me a hard time. It's normal. Totally normal. I'm going to keep attacking Ocarina. That's fun as well. That makes the, the playthrough even better. Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, well, at least we're finding stuff, right? Do you see anything? Oh, that's Impa. Yes. Oh, my. Your father has been captured. What about Link? He's been in a terrible fight. I can't tell what happened. I thought you said the king taking the Triforce earlier was going to protect them. Do you see anything? Yes? Oh, my. You're oh, my. I'm stupid. <laughs> the Triforce is a piece of shit. <laughs> what well, we'll good are the Triforces? Bullshit. Oh my god, Ocarina of Time. Thank you for getting a gift sub from Crash. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Crash, thank you for the gift sub to a piece of shit. I appreciate it, man. That's really kind. You don't have to do that. <laughs> the Triforce is a piece of shit. <laughs> what good is it? Nothing. Can you go in here? You can. All right, good. Crash, thank you very much for the gift sub. Ryan Pyro, what is up, sir? How's it going today, man? <laughs> You're playing Ninja Gaiden 2 the other morning. I saw that. I hope that went well. You're on really early. A lot of times I pop in because sometimes I'm awake like in the middle of the night. So I'm like, I'll just drop in and then try and go back to bed. Hope you're enjoying that. It's cutscenes are what some people see as their sleep paralysis demon. I know. It's insane. I, these cutscenes are so... Whoa! What? Where did this guy come from? Did he follow me in? Okay, I don't know about that. Where does this go? All right, we're just exploring. I don't know anything right now. Uh, uh, can you go through the window? Now I'm going to have to check every window because apparently that one went somewhere. The other one did. All right, we have uh, flying enemies. T pterodactyls are definitely a Zelda enemy right there if you've ever seen one. Look at the sword. Like The, the, the attack range looks like really bad, but it's bigger than it would appear, which is actually... Damn it. Oh, where am I going to start? Okay, you start back here. Okay, good. It works like Zelda 2. It's got lives. Like, once you run out of lives, it puts you back on the map screen, just like Zelda 2. See, I'm finding things that are familiar. I know what's going on here. I didn't know I have a clue about Ocarina. This game, I'm actually, like, starting to figure out what this is. What the hell is this? Arpagos Egg. All right, what does this do? All right, she doesn't say anything different. Yeah, what is this egg thing I got? All right, it's in my inventory. All right, we're going to need it at some point, I'm assuming. Uh, Crash, now the gift sub to Wand of Gamelon. All right, Wand of Gamelon, enjoy the gift sub from Crash. That You're much cooler than Ocarina. Ocarina can get the hell out of here, but Wand of Gamelon, you're welcome to stay here. Thank you very much for, the, uh, for being here and getting a gift sub. Thank you, Crash. So much better. Mr. Pill, welcome in. Valo, welcome in. Is that not an enemy from Link to the Past Dark World? Actually, I think you're right. Those little flying uh, pterodactyl things. I think you're right about that, Grimdark. Birds are here. They are. Music rips off that damn Nirvana song and I can't unhear it. Which one? I'm not putting it together and I've listened to a lot of Nirvana. Which one? It's not Smells Like Teen Spirit, is it? Oh, you can go in that door too? Okay. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. Dude, I... No! <laughs> okay, what do you do here? <laughs> the wall in the way. God damn it. I didn't even know you could go in here. I don't know what you can go in and out of. Crash, thank you again for the gift sub. My favorite Dark Souls game. This is also better than Dark Souls. This is way better. Let's try bombs. 
Oh my god! The inventory screen, it's the same button as going through doors! That's so bad! Why did they do that? I don't even know how to use bombs. Which button uses bombs? Is it gonna hurt me? No, but it blew up the barricade. Okay, good. Progress. All right, now, we're, we're, is this gonna go to a dungeon or something, right? Dude, these enemies. All right, there was a skeleton there that died in one hit. Was that supposed to be the boss or something? Anywhere else to go here? Zelda meets ghouls and ghosts. See something else I like? I like that! Is there anything else here? Mm, does not appear to be, okay. Okay, I'm gonna look around just in case because it looks like it's easy to miss stuff in this game. Really easy. <laughs> Shouldn't manage your inventory in a doorway. That's a fire code violation. This game won't let you do it. If you try and pull up your inventory next to a door, you go through the door. That is incredibly stupid. Like right now, see, normally you would do inventory, you have to press down and hit the X button. So that brings up inventory. But the same button, you press it, you go through a door. So if you're in front of a door, you can't pull your inventory up. That is ludicrous. Absolutely ludicrous. Doors locked. All right, that is a blacksmith shop from an anvil on the door. All right, I'm going to write down that there's another locked door here. Okay, so maybe that's where we'll get something later in the game. All right, locked door. This is still in Sakato, blacksmith. Okay. All right, that might help us at some point down the road. All right, is there anything in here? Okay, we already went through that. There's another, there's like a, I think there's a dark room on the, I don't know how to get back. I don't know how to get back. What was this? Oh yeah, that was nothing. Oh my dear, the trifle sucks. All right, wait, there was a dark room in here too, right? Here, yeah, okay, th there's a dark room and I don't have a lantern yet. I have lantern oil, but you have to have a lantern first according to the manual, which I do not have. You can farm rubies here, by the way. All these guys respawn. All right, how many rupees do I have now? 214. All right, I'm gonna buy more stuff. I don't really know what to spend money on right now other than this crap. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm assuming what, how, what's like my Mac, don't go back out the door. 11 bombs, 14 bombs. All right, so we, it gives you three at a time. All right, good. I haven't used any of these ropes yet. I don't know what any of this shit does. I'm just like guessing. Zelda's Adventure used live actors for the sprites. Oh, great. That's probably even worse than this. Zelda Hack of Ghosts and Goblins or Ghouls and Ghosts would be cool. I'd love that. I hope people would make that one day. If they do, I'll play it because I love ROM hacks. ROM hacks are usually, to me, like more memorable and more fun than real games. Because <laughs> it's like new content that I haven't seen yet. All right, we're almost out of rupees, by the way, but I did buy a bunch of crap. All right, so now I don't really know what to do. We went everywhere, I think, in this town. I guess we can try and go somewhere else. All right, save game. Game one. Continue. All right, we're making a little progress. All right, so we could go here or we could go here. What about over here? Nope, can't go over there. Can go in the castle yet? Nope, can't go there, can't go there. Maybe all this stuff unlocked. Can we do other stuff? I don't know. Edge, what's going on? How's it going today? I saw that RZ game. Yeah, it's apparently made by the same people that made these. Edge, it's like a new type of game. Use a rope to hang yourself in this game. No, that's only reserved for if you're playing Ocarina of Time, Lord Awesome. I'm good here. <laughs> I'm fine with this. <laughs> Barely anyone talks about Zelda's Adventure and what I've seen is just bad, bad, not funny jank. We'll play it at some point. Mi Mixer needs to play Mega Man 2 all quick man. Okay, sounds good, I can beat quick man. Beardman, what's going on? Who made me play this game? I chose it, because clearly it's better than Ocarina. Space Hamster, hope you're having a good day. Always good to see you comparing this game positively to Zelda 2 with Sin. I'm finding things I like. I know, like everybody's getting mad at me because I'm having a good time with this, right? Next round of bob bombs for Mixer. Bring them! Bring them! You can't hurt me in Mario Kart, Wolf. What if I just crush you next time we play? Then, then you'll just go quiet and be like, oh, that's right, I got destroyed. That's right. Oh, this is new. We haven't been here yet. Moblins. Try me? Okay, fine. Bring it. 
Well done on that, that Sypha only run. You're like the third person in the world to do that. Welcome to the club of three. Me, you, and Rydia. Sypha only, Castlevania three, staff only, no spells, and you completed it. So that's three of us. Anybody else want to join in on that challenge? It's a lot of fun. I loved it. Rydia and Wolf also loved it. So yeah. <laughs> Dude, how do you navigate this? What am I even looking at here? Like, I don't know. Like, the, the path doesn't make sense. I'm down here now. Now I'm up here. Now I'm over here. Like, how do you walk around here? Please don't. Actually, please do. It's like Castlevania 3. It's a great challenge. We're fighting Moblins, by the way. You go in here? Oh, shit. There's a key up there. Block! the hell is that? Like a... the hell is that? That's not a Zelda enemy. Is he, what? Does anybody know what that thing is? Dead. That's what it is. Alright, can I get the key? Minus Fate, what's going on? Welcome in. They did love it, I know. They absolutely loved it. I did. A great challenge on your mortality. <laughs> Wait till I do it one credit clear. Oh, you can climb this. Oh, shit. Okay. I probably need the lantern before I'm supposed to be in here, but I don't know where that is. Supposed to be a gorilla? No, that's a, that's a mop. That can't be a gorilla. Those have boomerangs. There's no way. Those don't look like that, do they? Got the key. All right. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be here yet, but I got it. <laughs> I have no idea where we're trying to go. All right. Uh, left. Okay. Now I don't know how to get out of here. All right, there was a rope you could climb. There it is, okay. <laughs> All right, good, we're getting stuff, we're making progress. This is already going way better than Ocarina for did, did for me many years ago. Projectile looked like a boomerangish. maybe that is a gorilla, I have no idea. Or maybe we haven't found those yet, maybe that's something else. Excuse me? Oh, I'm back here again. Okay. Can I just drop down over here? Is that going to kill me? Oh, they can hit me from down there. That's bullshit. Okay. Can we just... Look at the paths in this game. They, they make no sense at all. This makes no sense. Google says it's a vire. The hell is that? What Zelda game are those in? Not any that I've ever played. A vire? What is that? Oh, no. Make a great omelet here. Thanks. <laughs> what? what was that? That was weird. I don't want to see that again. <laughs> what the hell happened? <laughs> what were they thinking with these weird cutscenes? Holy shit. I don't get it. All right, there's another place we can go over there. Apparently, that's the exit right there. Let's we'll see what's over here. I don't even know what land I'm in here. All right, well, that was easy. Oh, my God, we found the lantern. Oh, my God. All right, well, that's a big deal. How do you... Okay, so there's lantern. We got this flute, too. Let's try the flute. I wonder what that does. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> nothing! And it doesn't even make a noise! Alright, well that's weird. Fire the blue hopping monster and Zelda once went into the red key spats. Those are those things? For some reason I've never heard their name before. Okay, so that's what that was supposed to be? Look like anything I've ever seen. <laughs> okay, that's fascinating. Crash, thank you very much. Have you played this before? Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for the gift subs. Have you actually played through this? I, you know, I'm kind of liking it. I'm not going to apologize for liking it. <laughs> we're, we're making some progress here, which, is, which feels good. <laughs> Thank you for dropping in. Caffeine, what's going on, man? Link looks funny. This is not Link. This is a princess. This is, this is Princess Zelda. Oh, I think you're supposed to, there was another exit over here. Maybe it'll go somewhere else. And then you'd be checking windows because apparently that's a thing. The windows you can go through in certain houses, which is extremely strange. So I, I forgot to do that. All right, maybe can you go through this window up here? 
No, you can't. All right, it was worth a shot. Or what well, about this chest? No. Caffeine, how you doing? Is it Zelda the green guy? Yeah, that's Zelda, the green guy. Exactly. All right, so there's nowhere else to... Hold on, let me talk to Impa. You've explored this place to the best of your ability, dearie. Okay, good. Well, did the Triforce tell you that? Because if it did, it's probably wrong. All right, what about this place? So you get a clue here. You've explored this place to the best of your ability. Okay, good. We're getting clues about like what we're completing and what we're not. That's a big deal. All right, how about here now? Uh, Gibdo is taking up residency in the church. He's shrouded in darkness. Maybe he's shrouded the key to his unwrapping. Oh, 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 wait, hold up. We can do stuff here now. Th there was a locked door earlier and a room that was dark. Okay, I can explore that dark room now, but I got a key earlier, so maybe that key will unlock the door in this town. God damn it. That map music is nice. Poor old Hilton, welcome in. Yes, the map music is good. The music for, like, roaming around, too, is also decent. The door's locked, by the way. Still can't do anything with that. That's the lady that wants the... What did you want? Hold on, let me talk to her again. Isn't it lovely? Bring some fairy dust and I'll make it a magic cloak. All right, she wants fairy dust. We're going to write that down. I should have written that down earlier, but I was so disturbed by like how psychotic she looked that I forgot. All right, so fairy dust for magic cloak. We're going to write that down. We have a quest to work on. That is really psychotic looking, by the way. Okay, uh, back over here. All right, said something about a church. Okay, we found a key there. For the dead shall rise, and the living shall be their slaves. She must be stopped. Is that the guy we're trying to kill? There's another room to explore before we do that. Hold up, we'll go back to that. I don't even think I found that before. I have to go through this window. What the hell is that? RPG Vandal, welcome in. Get her some more angel dust. I don't think she needs it. I think she's high as a kite on something anyway with eyes like that. <laughs> How am I not hitting those guys? Look, dude, look at that. <laughs> Drop Dash, welcome in. What's going on? Hope you're having a good deal. That's Mun yeah, that's Mumra right there, clearly, right? RPG Vandal, how's it going? I noped right out of that room. I'm trying to find the other room that was dark. I think it's right here. Let me reset the room and stuff. Let me leave. Hold up. I think you get your lives back when you go back to the map screen. No, I forgot to save. Hold up. Let me save it. Are we gonna need all this crap? Probably. All right, let me save it. You can save it whenever you're on the map screen. At least, at least you don't have to die to save it like you do in some of the other Zelda games. All right, continuing right along, Sakato. All right, block that. I think the hitboxes in this game are just really strange. Like, it looks like I'm not able to hit these guys, but I'm actually hitting them from like a mile away. That's very generous. I kind of like it, even though it's not realistic. All right, so what's going on in here? Let me try to figure out... Okay, the inventory and the door are exactly the same button. All right, so lantern, how does this work? We haven't tried the lantern yet. Okay, now I can see in the room. We figured that out. Is there anything in here? Oh my God, I'm doing everything right. Power sword. Okay, it fired a shot. How? To, okay, maybe it only works at full health. Maybe like as other Zelda games. We got a sword upgrade. Look at that. All right, it shows up in the inventory as well. There's a Z on our shield. Z for Zelda. See that? Rob, what's going on? <laughs> Dude, I'm you know I'm actually having fun. I think people are offended that I'm having fun with this game. <laughs> How's it going today, Rob? Welcome in. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. All right, I know how to get back outside now. And you can farm rubies from these guys. Those, uh, these are called Darius or something. I think those are the things from Death Mountain and Zelda 2, I think. Rob, how's it going? Jumbler, welcome in. The game does look fun. I'm kind of liking it, Jess. 
<laughs> I'm kind of having fun. Rob, how you doing, man? Welcome in. Jumbler, good to see you. I mean, it's some kind of fun. I, it kind of is. I, I don't hate this at all. I'm, I'm getting somewhere. We just got a sword upgrade. We're going to save the game and go back in where that guy was. Oh my god, now I'm unstoppable. Now I have a range attack that's on all the time. I get, I'm assuming it's only for full health, though. So when I get hit, I'm going to lose this ability, and we're going to be screwed. That's what's going to happen. <laughs> Got a certain pleasant DOS quality. It does! Well, what's the problem here? It's dank jank, I know, right? Play the remote so much fun, or somewhere beginning in F. Yeah, I can't do that, unfortunately, because uh, I couldn't get the original version to work. That's why I had to play this version. But I don't own a CDI controller, and people say that's like really, really, really awful. But unfortunately, I don't have one of those. So we can't do that. Maybe one day, though. Maybe I can find a way to get one. All right, let's go back to the church. Right down. Okay, it's kind of hard to navigate in this game. You don't really know where you can go. Victor turns the game into a shmup. Brimguard, what's going on? No. You, you don't try and ruin my fun. Don't try and tell me I'm playing a shmup now. You're going to make me hate it. We saw this guy talk already. Mighty Vic Viper can do that sword shot too. Yeah, and then it can get hit once and die. Zelda can get hit like six times. She's way more powerful than that piece of crap. And you know it, coffee. Zelda thinks shmup where Zelda morphs into a jet and goes into space. Let's not do that. Let's just not. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. I wonder which rupees are worth what. Uh, lantern, let's try that. All right, the, it's, the controls in this are like really hard to deal with. All right, here we go. All right, so, okay, you can jump on the organ. That's interesting. I can't go up any higher. Am I going to need one of these ropes? I haven't used a rope yet. I'm assuming maybe we're going to need that. And thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate it. Doll Vader, welcome in. I already know you from Sean's channel and other places, but welcome in. Good to see you. Hope you're having a wonderful day. We're playing some, uh, what is this, Wand of Gamelon? Oh, crap, the lantern. Oh, you have to use it again. It, just, it doesn't stay on. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Well, now we know that. <laughs> Doll Vader, welcome in. I can jump on your organ too, Jumbler. I don't think I will, but thanks for the offer. CDI controller wasn't the only uh, control issue. It had an input lag that made it a nightmare to play. Okay, so I can't recreate the... Maybe it did... Re it, it's, it doesn't really like feel like it's lagged too badly. Which is good. I mean, I'm having enough trouble figuring things out anyway. Doll Vader, how you doing today? Welcome in. Good to see you. Hope you're doing wonderful. Things are going really good here. There's the guy we're supposed to kill. He's up there. That was the guy from the cutscene. Can I not hurt him? Okay, that didn't work. Is that costing a rope every time I do that? 23, hold up. Let's find out. That's really stupid if that's the way it works. It does not count. Okay, good. Okay, wait. He, they said to, oh, maybe I'm supposed to use this. I said something about this. This round, no, it's gone. That's it. That's it. That was the entire boss fight, was just that. I thought that was gonna like make him attack me or something. That's all you do? You throw a blanket at him. Visibly melts, welcome in. I'm, you know what, that's really disappointing. I thought it was actually gonna be like a real fight. I thought I was gonna throw that at him and it was gonna like start the fight or something. He just dies straight up. And that's it. Wow! <laughs> what the hell is that? Oh my god, still having fun? I was hoping for more, Rydia. <laughs> I was hoping more would happen than that, but apparently not. All right, let's uh, check the town. 
Once you've found some fairies to give you their dust, Lika should be able to weave a nice magic cloak for you. If you hit select on the uh, screen, it gives you a hint about like what's going on in the area. Lika must be that woman with the psychotic eyes, I'm assuming, on the other side of town. All right, so we got to find fairies, fairy dust or something. All right, so that's like the next thing I guess we should be working on. I don't know. Uh, inventory, how many items do I have? I've got 23 bombs, 23 ropes, and 21 lantern oil, and 220 rupees. I think we're in pretty good shape. I don't know what that flute does, but I do have that. No, no! If you're not... You, uh, shut up. We're not talking to this guy. All right, I'll, can, how many bombs and stuff can I actually hold? Dude, you can hold a lot of items in this game. You like, I'm not like hitting a limit. 26 of all this stuff that's impressive all right back to the okay all right well and now i don't know what there's like a new area opened up over there we could look at that or we could check this area out i've already been to okay is there anything else going on here oh if, have i not been here that's new isn't it all right i think that was new what about this you explored this place to the best of your ability okay if you hit select it gives you clues all right so this is Yokon the fisherman picked the most dreadful spot to try casting his net. Bring something to blast rock and free him, dearie. Oh, I've got bombs. Do you think that'll work, Impa? I've got bombs. All right, well, I have something to blast with. All right, you know what? This overpowered sword is awesome. Zelda's a fairy dust dealer. Apparently so in this world. <laughs> there is no Navi here. That's why this game is good. The Navi is not here. And it's not in 3D, so see, I'm finding a lot I like about this game. There's no Navi, there's no 3D, there's no Hyrule Field boring bullshit. There's actually things going on. Oh my god, okay, that was a bit of a jump scare. All right, was well, that an Octorok? <laughs> what the hell was that? Oh my god, that was kind of frightening looking. All right, you... Got him, all right. I'm so hungry, I could eat an Octorok. That's what Link said earlier. Oh, that kills you if you drop down there. All right, well, that didn't look like I could die there, but whatever. <laughs> Dude, the places you can die in this game are kind of ridiculous. Like, that kill... Is it... Where did that even come from? Dude, this kicks ass. It's fine. <gasps> no! Wait, what? <laughs> okay, what do you do with that? Can't jump over this? No, and I'm dead, just like that, all right. Game is wrong, but whatever. I don't get it right there. I don't know how I'm supposed to get past that. There's nowhere to go. There's nowhere to go right there. <laughs> I, Navi's like the worst character in the history of video games. Change my mind. I bet you can't. Mixer needs Ocarina with Navi removed. It's still got Hyrule Field and like no enemies, so it'd still be extremely boring. It'd be like a little better if Navi wasn't there, but I mean, that, that's not gonna fix it for me. It would make it a, a, just a, a minute better. All right, this guy, he's, yeah, he was a hit and run, okay. Okay, so how do you get past this gorge? Can I not jump that? can jump over it okay nice jump over the goma pit here have a drink thanks hey there's a fisherman trapped in the fish head really really <laughs> goobs that wouldn't even be close that would not even be close. <laughs> it was a Goma. I thought it was an Octorok or something. Okay, you're right. It was a Goma. Does anyone like Navi? I think everyone hates Navi. See how bad the game is, Pookum? See how bad it is? It's awful. Navi ruined that game for a lot of people. Actually, most people seem to love it. They feel the magic of Ocarina. I don't do that bullshit. It was a Goma pit you should have known. I thought it was an Octorok. I don't know what this game's trying to do. Sue me. All right, uh, bombs, I guess. It said you could use a bomb. It, you need something explosive. Yeah, blast a rock and free him. Okay. Okay, that didn't do shit. Or they have Navi over... No, you would not, Drop Dash. Absolutely not. The background is metal. I, you know, the background actually is uh, nothing. <laughs> 
absolutely nothing. Rat, what's up? This is Zelda I was hitting it. Yes, this is it. This is a very janky Zelda game. You actually play as Princess Zelda in this one. I, I'm having a good time. This is rated like one of the fifth best, uh, fifth worst games of all time. And uh, I'm kind of liking it, so I'm really not surprised by that. Are you nice gonna... jump over the Goma pit. Okay. Here, have a drink. Thanks. The way she's hey, looking at me like that is kind of creepy. Fish head. Really? <laughs> All right, that gives you health back. That's good. All right, I hit that with a. Okay, I'm hitting that with bombs. Bombs don't do anything. I, it says explode. Bring something to blast rock and free him. I'm using bombs. It's not doing anything. <laughs> Okay, so maybe this doesn't work. Oh, it takes like 20 bombs. All right, never mind. <laughs> really? <laughs> the cutscenes of this are awful. They're awfully bad. Oh my God, there's another guy to talk to in here. Oh my God. Thanks, you saved me. That's the last time I'm going fishing. See you in Cicado. <laughs> <laughs> That's it! I thought it was gonna be like a dungeon or something! That's all you do? I thought that was gonna be like level one or something. Alright, apparently, guess what? It's not. And now that we're done with that. This is unbelievable. <laughs> this is unbelievably jank! Alright, let's go back to town. Can we find that guy? He said he was going back to Sakato, and that's where this is. <laughs> he couldn't get out of the ribs, apparently not. This looks wonderful. It's a charming jank rat. It's right up your alley. I I'm having fun. Suppose I'm on your side, but I still have to sell the stuff. Just pick what you want. I'll handle the rubies. This is so ridiculous. It's so bad it's good. That's the way I'm looking at it. Never journey in the land of lepers. That's, yeah, and that, that guy's scary looking, man. <laughs> so now there's some lake zone we can go to as well. That just opened up on the map. It's like when you complete an area, more things open up on the map. I just died. All right, doesn't really, dying doesn't really matter that much in this game, it feels like. It really doesn't change a whole lot. All right, so where's that guy that said he was going here? He, he said he was going to the town. Is it, he's not in there. Man, oh, I bet he's in this locked door. I bet he's right here. Nope. Wrong. Rupees! I know, right? I can't get over that. It's supposed to be rupees. This is Zelda rupees. Oh, you guys need to see this. For you guys that are just joining us, look how insanely psychotic this woman is in the cutscene. You're going to love this. <laughs> this is great. Isn't it lovely? Bring some fairy dust and I'll make it a magic cloak. Isn't it lovely? <laughs> I'll see it again. I'll show it again because the, the, uh, the sub thing got in the way. But Rapid Dragoon, welcome in. Thank you for the five months, dude. How you doing today? Hope you're having a great day. Welcome to, uh, what is this called? Wand of Gambelon. I keep forgetting the name of this game. But yeah, this is Zelda Wand of Gambelon for you guys just joining us. Rapid Dragoon, how's it going, man? Thank you very much for the five months. I appreciate it so, so very much. Stop subbing. We need to watch the crazy lady. We'll watch her right now. Christoph, what's up? Welcome in. <laughs> how's it going? <laughs> You're just in time to see the lady. Yeah, I know. It was getting covered up. <laughs> Probably for the best, so here we go. Isn't it lovely? <laughs> Bring some fairy dust and I'll make it a magic cloak. Okay, look at those eyes. Stare deeply into those eyes. <laughs> oh my god, this game is just one incident like that after another. <laughs> uh, what are we supposed to be doing here? Found fairies to give you their dust. Lika should be able to weave a magic cloak. Okay, that's no update. I, I don't have dust, Jumbler! We don't have that yet. We have a flute, lantern, shroud, which we use to kill the mummy guy. Ropes, bombs, and that's it. And some, maybe this is, 
I don't know what why there's a purple cloak down there in the bottom right. I have no idea. It won't let me access that. I don't know what that is. All right, does Impa say anything different in here? Let's talk to her again. Do you see anything? Yes. Oh my, your father has been captured. What about Link? He's been in a terrible fight. I can't tell what happened. You can't help at all. The tri you know what? That's why you can't help because the Triforce is a piece of shit. That's why it's worthless. She was like, oh, the king is taking the Triforce of Courage. He's going to be just fine. And then the, like all hell breaks loose and Link's gone. The king's gone. And now Zelda sets out with a dinky little sword to try and help everyone. That's uh, this, our story so far. I'm about to die again here. All right. Can I go in here now? Look, I got a new job. Hey. Bring a heat crystal. I'll fix up your sword. Look, I got a new job. Okay, well that sounds like a quest to me. All right, I'm gonna write that down. All right, heat crystal. Heat crystal for new sword, maybe? I'm gonna put new sword and then a question mark because I don't know. All right, why was he flexing? I don't know, but I don't want to see that again. That was, like, disturbing. Filthy Cur, happily quirky, welcome in. Maybe she's going to like this game more than Ocarina of Time. Oh, I'm liking it a lot more, Filthy Cur. Welcome in, man. Apron with no shirt under it. <laughs> I can't unsee that now, god damn it. I got a new job. Hey, bring a heat crystal. I'll fix up your sword. I like when he flexes, like muscles appear. Like, how could they let this happen? What's the Triforce done here in the CDI Zelda Cinematic Universe? That is nothing. The, the Triforce is a worthless piece of crap. Ocarina is way better, but this game is okay. And I, I think, I think Ocarina is garbage, and this game is okay. That's my opinion. <laughs> I like this way more. You guys probably should not be surprised by that, that I like this more than Ocarina. I'm having way more fun with this. I'm not, this game has not made me bored yet. Whereas Ocarina was nothing but boredom from beginning to end. Or as far as I made it, I made it the Water Temple. And that's a fine place to never play it again. Uh, 284 rupees. Maybe I should buy more bombs. It was like 10 bombs earlier to like blow that rock up. So maybe we need more stuff here. Not like rupees are very hard to get. You just farm them here in the town anytime. I mean, look at his animation though. He bangs on the anvil. Then can, can we go watch for a second? No, we can never see that again. That's what I noticed too. He flexes his body, expands like a zip, being popped. <laughs> Those sides are gonna be hurting after this stream. Mine too. This is hilarious. The, the jank level of this game is off the charts. And what you know, I like that. I don't, this game was like rated as like the fifth worst game of all time or something. I'm not seeing that at all. I'm kind of having fun here. And Rana Compton, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Good to have you here. Thank you so very much. Things are going well here. We're making some headway. We're getting some items. We're learning where, where, where we can farm. We're getting quests. Things are going pretty good. I'm having a good time. There hasn't been a whole lot of difficulty as far as combat so far, but it's kind of like, this is a game where you have to figure out what you're trying to do more so than combat, at least so far. Maybe it'll get harder as we get deeper in the game. So there's like a castle here, it's like a tree forest here, there's a tower here, it's a castle here. So see, it's gonna get a lot harder, I'm assuming, as we make more progress. And how is it going to, uh, maybe you can change your opinion after you played Ocarina? We'll see, we'll see, I have an open mind. What exactly am I seeing? The really, really, that's a perfect clip. Everyone I've seen play this enjoyed it. <laughs> this game has gotten too much hate. Way too much hate. I'm not seeing... Okay, so we can go to Shutoi Lake. Where else can we go? Is that where I'm, I, I don't know where I'm supposed to be. We can go to Taikogi Tower. We haven't been to either of those places yet. So there's things to work through here. We can't go to that shipwreck. We, I think this is where, I, this is where you, the start of the game. Uh, do we have anything else here to do? Nothing. Okay, good. So, I don't know what to do now. <laughs> I have no idea. We can go to the lake. There was like another place here on the map we could go to as well also. Not there. there was like a swamp place it showed me earlier. I don't know how to get back to that though. 
here. Okay, we could go here and here. This popped up earlier on the map, so it should probably do this in like order. Oh my god, look at the. Oh, that kills you straight away. Okay. Can I jump on the. Oh my god, you can ride the gator. Okay, I see how this might work now. Or not. Okay, that did not work too well. Alright, there's a lot of enemies here. And jump on the branches? Yes? I don't know what I can do. Like, what's part of the background and what isn't? Look, it, see, like, it looks like Zelda's in the background right there. But, like, this looks like it's in the foreground. And this is, like, in the middle of the screen. It's very hard to see what's happening here. It's really hard to see. What? <laughs> I don't know where I can go and where I can't. <laughs> I have no idea. Hey, I'm riding the gator. It's like Pitfall. I wouldn't have known to jump on the gator if it wasn't for Pitfall. Anytime I see a gator in the water like that, I'm like, oh, I bet we could ride or jump on that. I bet that would be just fine. All right, the hitboxes in the game are actually very generous. They're good. Can I jump on the gator from here? No. Okay. Can I even make this jump? They probably won't. What? Bullshit! Back here again. Okay. <laughs> Where you fall, you can't go? Well, that's a problem because a lot of times when I... See, when I fall... Okay. Okay, so the gator... I don't know, like, dude, it's hard to know where you can go. It did like the, the screen's a mishmash of nonsense. It does not make any sense. Okay, jump on the gator. <laughs> What the hell, dude? All right. Like, when you run out of lives, it puts you back on the, uh, back on this screen. So, you have a limited... You do have lives in this game, but when you... See this heart where it says three underneath where it says shroud? When you run out of hearts there, that's lives, you get kicked back to the map screen. You have to start the section over. So, that's the punishment for dying in this game. But otherwise, there's not, like, a lot of pun... Not, like, a lot of punishment for dying. God... Jeez! Okay, this is getting a lot harder now. This section is a huge step up in difficulty over the other stuff compared to what we were dealing with a minute ago. I really don't need to get hit because if you get hit, you lose your sword beam. It works like other Zelda games. You're at max health. You have a range attack. We really need to make... And I got hit by nothing. Better than Ocarina of Time. That's, that's right. I'm actually enjoying it a lot more than Ocarina of Spirit, buddy. I am. By the way, one of your games is coming up soon that you recommended to me a while back. Uh, it Batman and Robin on Super Nintendo. That was a game you reg your name is next to that game on my list, and we're going to play that fairly soon for Super Nintendo. I've done the Genesis version, but I've never seen the Super Nintendo one. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to playing that one. But that was your recommendation. God damn it! How do you not get hit here? The hitboxes are way too big. My hitbox is big, but so are the enemies, so maybe it should balance out. I was once a man, I know the evil men do. Do not bring your evil jacks. Don't do songs. They're going to be stuck in my head all day. This is insanely like... <laughs> hard to navigate this section. It's, it's, this is by far and away. I don't... There's nowhere to go. It's a dead end. What's the point of this place? Maybe I'm not even supposed to be here yet. I don't know. And thank you very much, son of PR24. Thank you very much for the sub with Prime Gaming. I appreciate it, sir. Good to have you here. How you doing today? Welcome to... What is this? Wand of Gamelon? I keep forgetting the name of this game, but yeah, it's Wand of Gamelon. Welcome in. And I'm, I'm enjoying it, believe it or not. I'm having some fun. I really want to figure out where to go here. <laughs> okay, the gator goes into the water and it kicks you off the gator, so you... Okay, let's wait on the gator. The hitbox is huge, man. Peter Merkin, welcome in. How's it going today? Dude, you're supposed to go in that tiny Smurf house in the background. 
The, look, the, the perspective isn't even right here. You're supposed to go in this room right here. That's in the background and it's letting me go in there. My hitbox is huge, Glove. Look at this. You're enjoying Wand of Gamelon yet, Death Merc? I am. Glove, how's it going today? <laughs> She's going in the Smurf house. You see that? That's what it looks like to me. <laughs> She's freaking huge. Perspective, you're so demanding. I don't get this perspective. It's hard to see, like, what can I jump on? What's part of the background? What is going on here? I don't really get it. It's very hard to see what's happening. All right, make sure you keep the range attack. The range attack is really good. You want it. By the way, if you want to pick the rubies up, rupees, you have to hit them with your sword. Oh, lost my range attack. Nice. All right, I'm assuming I have to go in that shack up there. Can I jump on the gator? It's not letting me jump on the... Am I just dead now? Oh, really? Okay. Okay, well, I, at least I saw it on the second screen now. See, I guess you're dead if you just fall. Do not fall down there. Oh, my God. Do not fall again. <laughs> Dude, if you lose a range attack, you're just dead. You need it to get through this. You really, really, really need it. All right. Platforming is worse than Wizard of Oz. Dude, at least I could see what to jump on in Wizard of Oz. This is just a mess. Oh, great. I'm down here again. I'm, there's no way out, I don't think. I don't think you can get out of here. Jump on the gator. Jump on the gator. Jump on the gator. GATOR! No! <laughs> now I'm all the way back in the first part again. God damn it. Big Dave, what's going on? Welcome in. This is insane. The, the difficulty's gone up a lot now. The Zelda and animations are amazing. Can't pick it, Jank. You're right. You're right. This is this is the best example of like charming Jank I think I've ever seen. I like this game. This is fun trying to figure out this kind of stuff. Ocarina just bored me to tears. This is actually entertaining. I don't care what people think about me for enjoying this game. Deal with it. <laughs> Least I'm not bored. At the end of the day, I wasn't bored. All right, go back in the Smurf house. We're back in the second. We're back in the section again. If you drop down to that log down there at the bottom, you die. There's no way out of it. You can't jump on the gator from there. All right, so I'm assuming what we do from this branch is land on the gator and go to the right. Okay, enemies are going to keep respawning there. That's not good. All right, so how do you do this part? Need this Zelda emote? Clearly, right? Not, this Zelda would make a good emote. Maybe I'll make one. I do like making my own animated emotes. I could make this, no problem. Alright, I don't know where to go here. This doesn't make any sense at all. Gator emotes risen up 30. This gator could be an emote too. You want me to make one? It's an empty Hyrule field. Charming. Why, gee, why? No, that's the worst thing ever. It's one of my least favorite things I've ever dealt with in a video game. was Hyrule field in uh, Ocarina because it's the epitome of boredom. Jump on it! <laughs> Maybe change your opinion. Uh, odds are very low that my opinion will change on Ocarina. We'll see. I'll be honest, if I like it, I'll tell you straight up, I would never lie to you guys about my opinion about a game. If I hate a game, you'll be also be the first to know, but I don't think you, uh, I don't think you, uh, need to know whether I hate a game. It'll be pretty easy to tell. Yes! Oh! You don't even have to jump on the gator. You can just jump, st you can just jump straight from the, uh, branch over to the house. Oh, okay. Oh, great, there's someone in here. Hmm, aren't you a might puny to go up against Ganon? I'll do all right. That's the spirit. Bring some hand, you spore, if you want a bit more punch. What? 
Okay, what zone are we in? The swamp? Uh, you said you wanted something? Alright, swamp. Alright, we have to see the cutscene again. Hmm, aren't you a mite puny to go up against Ganon? I'll do alright. Where? What item did you want? Hmm, aren't you a mite puny to go up against Ganon? I'll do all right. That's the spirit. Bring some hand, you spore, if you want a bit more punch. Hand, you spore. What the hell is that? Okay. That's the item we need. This is a quest. All right, we also are looking for fairy dust or something else. She'll do all right! <laughs> Zelda's a woman of few words. <laughs> <laughs> Dashi, welcome in. God, I feel like this game was made in the shadow of Chernobyl. <laughs> Who am I inspiring to play this next? Who wants to play this next? Clearly everyone. Lance, welcome in. False Image, welcome in. How are you guys doing today? It's going great. I'm really enjoying this. Ellie, Ellie, you want to play this? <laughs> Rat wants to play it. <laughs> Ellie, you're up next. <laughs> I can't play it. I don't have it. You can this, you can download this version of it. This version is for a download on for Windows PC. So anyone can play this. You got a PC. You have no excuses, none whatsoever. We finished that section. All right, hold up. I want to go back to that and talk to Impa. Speak to Grimbo, the mad alchemist, at the edge of the swamp. Once you have a spore from the Hanyu forest, you should see what he can transmute for you. Okay, well, that's nice. All right, so we're supposed to go here next. We're making some progress, man. Lance, you're doing good. Thanks for asking. That's what I want to hear, man. That sounds good. It's good, but not as good as Ocarina. The shit I took last night's better than Ocarina. Dashi, how are you doing today? Welcome in. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Tanichu, how you doing? I hope you're doing good. Can I swap Bubsy for this? You should be able to do that, because this game is far better. General Andrews, what is going on? How you doing today? Things are going good. We're having a good time. We're playing uh, Wand of Gamelon, and progress is happening. I like this game so far. I guess it's where we're supposed to be next. I have no idea. <laughs> she said something about something somewhere at some time. What are we getting? Con use force. General Andrews, what's up, man? Hope you're doing good. I'll take you up later to find out how you got this running. Rush, message me anytime. I'll be glad to help you. I will be glad. Red, what is going on? The Mad Alchemist. That doesn't sound safe. It's better than the Full Metal Alchemist, am I right? Those guys got into all kinds of trouble if you've seen that anime. When all phone hold music to be changed to the world map music from this game. This is good music, Rydia. I like it. I, I'm a fan. I'm well, hope everyone's doing okay, doing great here, having a good time. You know why we're not having a good time? Because we're, we're not playing Ocarina, we're playing a better Zelda game. Bet Hanyu Spores in the Hanyu Forest. Jumbler, you are a genius. You are a freaking genius. I bet so too. <laughs> I, something tells me it's in here, somewhere. I bet I can't jump over this gap. I knew it, all right. <laughs> Maybe if I get a running start. Aha! You can. Okay. Well, then why are all those enemies up there if you just jump over this stuff? Okay, you get knocked backwards. Alright, so maybe it's safer to go to the top path. You know what? We're going to do that. <laughs> I think going up here is safer. Yes, replace Bubsy 3D with this game. This game's a big upgrade over that. General, how's it going, man? Red Alchemist, anyone? Oh my god. You, you, you like the series? The series is really good. I saw that a long time ago, Full Metal Alchemist. Missed some flex action in this game? There was some good flex action going on with that weirdo back in town. What was that guy? That guy wanted an item to upgrade my sword or something? Wish I had the down stab move. Maybe you get that later. I don't know if that's in this game or not. All right, so I'm gonna stay on the top path here. I think that's safer. Right, just keep going. We'll be fine. Okay, where do you go here? This is a dead end. Does it go in that tree trunk? 
I, what? How did I die, dude? <laughs> what? what? What happened? <laughs> I didn't even fall. It just died right there, like right there in midair. That was weird. Okay, well, moving along. Environments don't look half bad. I think the graphics look good, Ark, but the problem is you can't like see what you can interact with. That's a problem. Like these trees look like they're actually in the background, but you can climb on them. It, it's really weird. And like I've died a lot simply falling in holes because I don't know like where I can stand and where I can. It's strange. Also, like play Hotel Mario Hotel. Oh yeah, Hotel Mario. I've heard of that. It's like a weird puzzle-like game. I guess you're supposed to go in this tree trunk. There's no other place to... You can. Okay, good. Good. All right, so... Where do you go from here? I guess this way? I don't know. You can also go up. This is just weird. Oh, we found it! Okay, well, that was quick and easy. Okay. Myra, the friendly forest fairy, will help out kind-hearted travelers. She's particularly fond of feathers. Perhaps you can pluck one from an Arpagos nest? Okay, that's something we haven't, like, been told anything about yet. Oh, God, there's somebody here. Greetings, Princess Zelda. Oh, God. Do you have any Arpagos feathers? <laughs> Greetings, Princess Zelda. Do you have any Arpagos feathers? Some kind of ogre woman. Okay. All right. Okay. We found some kind of ogre woman. All right. Where? What is this zone that we're in right now? I don't even remember the place. This is Hanyu Forest. Uh. So ogre woman wants something. Greetings, Princess Zelda. Arpagos Do you feathers. have any Arpagos feathers? I don't have any of those, but we'll write it down. All right, Harpagos Feathers from Ogre Woman. I'm gonna write that down. A Shrek's new girlfriend? I know, right? I know, everyone wants things. This is one fetch quest after another. I don't wanna to talk to you, I'm trying to kill the enemy. Okay, now we can go to the fairy pool. Okay, so like when you complete an area, it opens up something else. All right, uh, but we got it, uh, the Hanyu spore, so we can go back somewhere else and turn that in. So uh, that was here. Speak to Grimbo, the Mad Alchemist. Once you have a spore from the Hanyu forest, you should see if it can transmute. Okay, this is where we need to be, So, because I got the other item. So this should be adequate. I know, these characters are just psychotic. This is, I don't even think we're in Hyrule. We're in Gamelon. This is not the uh, Hyrule we all know and love. Actually, the Hyrule we know and love is in Zelda 1 and 2 and in uh, A Link to the Past. Those are the only Hyrules I know. Okay, I'm trying to get on the gator. You can't get on the... You can't. Dude, I don't know what I can jump on what I can't. I didn't know you could jump on this platform right here. That doesn't even make sense. Okay, now I can't go any further to the right. She's cute. I'd ask her out. I'm sure you would. And she would... Uh, she would accept right away, Jumbler. We just found you a girlfriend right there. Everyone's just very needy in this game. I want this. I want that. The Triforce of Wisdom is garbage. The, the king took the Triforce of Courage, so he'll be fine. But he's really not fine. Link is gone, too. He was early, He was in the game earlier. I missed the jump. God. Oh, now it lets me jump on the gator from there, but earlier it would not. All right. Well, that makes no You're sense back. at all. Now give me your glove. <laughs> Don't worry. Here. A power glove. Great. Hmm. Aren't you a might puny to go up against Ganon? I'll do all right. <laughs> all right, we got the power glove. It's so bad. All right, give me that. What does it do? Does it hit everything on the screen? Doesn't do anything. Dude, that's costing rupees! That costs 10 rupees every time I use it. It better do something damn good for that. 
I still don't know what this does. That costs ru dude, all these items cost rupees. I didn't know, dude, no wonder I don't have any rupees. It's draining them from using this garbage that doesn't do anything. All right, well that means I have to farm rupees again if I have to like use that item. I don't even know what, what the point is. It didn't tell me that. Yeah, a little late pushing the power glove. Can you help me, Princess? Given that you're a part of the governing family, I'm assuming you have nothing else to do. Need help finding my book of barbecue recipes. That's kind of the quest in this game. Go find a bunch of crap in the forest and bring it to me. And then I'll give you a power glove. Rubik's Cube? No, we don't need that. Ru Ru no, rubies! Rubies, not rupees. This game's got rubies. What is this fever dream? I don't know, but I hope I never wake up from it. Plabu, what's going on, man? Welcome in. How's it going today? I can't believe there's a power glove. It's perfect. Uh, cool, cloudy with no sun in sight. Perfect southern weather for once. Yeah, it's it's, uh, it's 67 degrees here. Actually, that's too hot for this time of year. That's okay. I guess that's a woman. I don't know. Wand of Gamelon. Power glove playthrough win. I, thankfully, I don't have a working power glove, Pookums. So I'm very happy that I do not have that. Because that way people can't ask for it. Which is really nice. <laughs> That is wonderful. We need Arpagos feathers. Where the hell do you get those? I have no idea. We could go to the fairy pool, or we could... Is there anything to do in Sakato? All right, they're still asking for fairy... Oh, we! I bet we can get fairy dust now! I bet we can get that, and then we can bring it here to that psychotic woman with the meth head eyes, and we could get some kind of upgrade, right? Probably something that doesn't do jack shit and just drains rupees, more than likely. All right, in the meantime... Wouldn't mind own this game? I wouldn't either. This is fun. Your alert mode, no problem, Plabu. I think thank you for dropping by. I really appreciate it, man. I'm I'm kind of enjoying this janky game. Alright, so uh you can pluck one from I don't know where an Arpagos nest is. I have no idea. What about Shoe Toy Lake? Wizrobe can only be beaten by his own spells. You'll need a way to reflect his attacks. He has the vain, or I mean, fair lady Alma captured. Maybe she'll reward you if you free her. We don't have a way to reflect spells. What do you want me to get? A shield? We have a shield. Wizrobe? We're going to find Wizrobes? Good. I hope so. I guess we'll go to the fairy pool. That's... We have rose and the fountain of life. Oh, that was good. We have made evil. Let's bring the darkness down. <laughs> okay, we need the lantern here. That was disturbing, all right. Uh, okay, now I can see, good. Okay, where, did, where am I supposed to go? Oh, was that one of the ones we were supposed to kill? <laughs> was that the boss? This game is like a bad trip. I know, right? <laughs> the voice acting's the best ever. It's like Mega Man 8. Meth head eyes, am I wrong? Quirky, that's what it looked like. That crazy woman back in town. Oh my god, okay. So they kill you like instantly. All right, neat. All right, uh, lantern oil back on. Music in this game is great. The music is honestly very high quality. I'm kind of surprised about that, Spirit Buddy. Tulip, what's going on? You implied this was voice in a sound booth, but it's some guy's garage. It's the same place that Mega Man 8 was voiced. Same exact place. God. Saved us. Here's a life heart and some fairy dust. Have some water of life. Have some water of life. Have some water of life. What is she doing? Twerking? 
<laughs> you see what I'm looking at? <laughs> what, what is this? What is this? Phidias, what's up? Wasn't expecting to see this today. You, you never know, man. <laughs> Phidias, how's it going, dude? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna make that an emote. Oh, no, I better not. Have some water of life. Have some water of life. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't make that an emote. Okay, in the meantime. <laughs> hilarious oh my god i love this game this, this game's getting better all the time all right uh inventory lantern i'm trying to get out of here now all right so we completed that wait i got fairy dust we can go back to that psycho woman right all right save game <laughs> i've got that written down here psycho lady wanted fairy dust or whatever They've been imprisoned a long time, too long, clearly. What have we unleashed upon the world? Yeah, better not make that a, a animated mode. That would be trouble. Won't lie, I'm tempted to play this too. This is fun jank, ready. I would recommend this game. By the way, I've got more hearts now. I have four now instead of, uh, I've got, I've got four instead of three. So I actually got a heart container upgrade. That's really nice. All right, so where was that psychotic woman? She was over here. Aha, yeah, she's got no feet, look. Sneak up and give a monster a good shot before he sees you. We can give a monster a good shot before he sees me. All right. <laughs> All righty then. That's interesting. All right, now you're gone. All right, what's this new... I believe that nice fisherman Yukon has taken up smithing now. I think he'll be able to temper your sword if you give him the right kind of crystal. All right, that's I've got that written down. And she's gone now. She's gonna show up as a boss later or something. And be like, I'll get you, dearie. <laughs> she's gonna be later in the game. I bet. I don't trust people that look like that. I'm sorry. That she was psychotic looking. All right. Uh, this crap costs rupees, by the way. All right, magic cloak. I don't know what this does. Let's try it. Dude, that is way too good. How many times can I use that? Does that cost anything to use? Let me try that again. 20 rupees to use it. But it may, it looks like it makes you invincible. Oh my god. Okay, that's like a... That's cheating. That is freaking cheating! You know what? I'm, I'm not going to use that item. I think that's cheating. Should we turn this into a no magic cloak run? Because I feel like that item could be abused. I'm serious here. I think that item's way too good. I don't think we should use that item. That's ridiculous. Yeah, this is going to be a no magic cloak run. I've decided we don't need that. Moving right along without it. Kind of like no E-Tank runs we do in Mega Man. We're going to do a no cloak run here in uh, whatever the hell this is. Wand of Gamelon. So that's how that's gonna work. It is useful, it's really good. You turn into Dark Zelda and now you have to fight yourself. It's like Shadow, it's just, it's Shadow Zelda, like Shadow Link, same thing. That's what I'm getting from it. <laughs> that's kinda cool. All right, well, that item's so good, I don't even wanna use it. All right, we can, can you go back to the fairy pool? All right, but it's dark here. I, it said I got water of life. I didn't, like, that didn't even show up in my inventory. I have no idea. Zuki Zero, what's going on? This is a fan. This is a remake of the original one. It adds. Let's, let me show, let me show you. It's got uh, options you can turn on where you can turn on remastered mode, and it gives you like unlimited lives. It makes the controls function normally and all that stuff. But I have that turned off, so we're playing it the the original way. So, and it's kind of hard to get used to, to the inventory and all kinds of crap. Zelda's Harry Paco, welcome in. I do not own a CDI, no. I wish I tried to get one for a while. I cannot get one that actually works. <laughs> They're like, all the CDIs I've ever tried in my life, they don't work. Zelda's welcome in. How you doing today? 
Ditalix, Woozy Dice, welcome in. Hope you guys are all doing well. Lemon Giuseppe, welcome in as well. I'm liking this absolute classic. I'm enjoying it. I absolutely am. I know, that is a great name. I agree. Zelda's Harry Taco is in the right stream. Because we're playing Wand of Gamelon, you play Zelda in this game. We can go to Shootoy Lake. What are we supposed to do next? What I have written down, Arpago's Feathers, the Ogre Woman wants those. But I don't know where we're supposed to go next. I have no. Oh yeah, that ship is also available. All right, I'm, but this says something about a Wizrobe. Wizrobe can be, be, be beaten by his own spells. You need a way to reflect his attacks. Maybe the cloak will do that. I have no idea. Maybe we have to use the cloak. I don't know. Maybe it's a required item. Lemon, how you doing, man? Ryan Walker, how's it going today? Hope you guys are doing well. Things are, uh, we're making a lot of progress with this game so far. This game is, it's strange the way you make progress. You talk to NPCs, you complete a level, it opens up another level, and NPCs, there's fetch quests to do. Are these supposed to be Dodongos? They don't look anything like them. Those are supposed to be orange. Rat should definitely play this, absolutely. I think this is a charming, this is a perfect example of a game that's jank, but it's kind of charming at the same time. I think it's fun. <laughs> Locked! Okay, we can't go this way. All right, so maybe I need a key from somewhere else. All right, so there's a locked door in what zone is this? Shoe Toy Lake? Let's go ahead and write that down. I, I like writing clues down. Shoe Toy Lake has a locked door that we cannot open yet, so I'm assuming we can come back and get this later. Locked door, I could see Rat having a blast with this. I could too. See, this is a fun game. Ocarina's just pure boredom. Oh, there's enemies in here, okay. I thought we were gonna find another charming person to talk to. There's nothing in here. What's the point of this room? It's empty. Nothing here. All right, is there anything? You can go inside the broken hut, really? And there's a key here? You can go inside that! Oh, I can't, okay, so there's more you can do in this game than I realized. I probably missed all kinds of stuff. You can go inside this. You really wanna get destroyed, don't you? Uh, you, won't des you won't destroy me, please. You're gonna get destroyed. You can get destroyed worse than you did in Street Fighter! How about that, Wolf? <laughs> That's right! Now we can go in the door here. <laughs> ah, Spade, what's up, buddy? Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day, sir. Good to see you. I love that emote, by the way. That is a wonderful emote. Celestial, welcome in. Uh, I loved every second of Ocarina. Okay, I'm glad you did. I hated every second of it. Funny how we have different opinions, isn't it? Let's talk to Impa. Oh dear, Wizrobe has captured Lady Alma. I'm not afraid of you. Ha! Then wait here until you are. Wait, what? Where are these other people? Robber, what's going on? You're always going to defend it? Well, I'm, I'm always going to trash it. <laughs> I'm always going to trash it. I, I don't know what happened. Oh, dear. Wizrobe has captured Lady Alma. I'm not afraid of you. Ha! Then wait here until you are. Does anybody understand that scene at all? Where are these other people? There's no one else in the room, but the other people are in the cutscene. What the hell? Dwarven Dad, welcome in. How's it going? I want to see more people try this game. Hey, Spade, play it. <laughs> oh, you can go over here. Okay, there's something different. All right, we're, we're fine. Oh God, more gators, good Lord. And there's stuff in the, there's flying fish, all right. All right, are the gator, are the gators gonna come back? We have more lives, that's fine. Okay, so apparently this is where you're supposed to go.
<laughs> it's hard to know where you can stand in this game. Like, sometimes the foreground you can stand on it, sometimes you can stand on the background, you just don't know until you die. falling and they're gonna kill you in like half a second all right let's try that again all the way back here okay there's gonna be rocks falling i don't have a thing that reflects Wizrobe's attack so that's what it says maybe they're talking about the cloak i don't know or maybe uh maybe the flute will work i don't know i have no idea we'll find out when we get there but this place opened up before anything else i'm assuming this is what we have to do next Zero recovery time, I know. You, I died like instantly right there. How many rupees do we have? 220? Okay. Dies in water doesn't bode well for water temple. I really don't want to deal with that, but we will. You know, I've never dreaded streaming a game more than Ocarina of Time. And mostly for the fact that it's just going to be extremely boring for me, just like it probably was long, just like it was long ago. But I don't know. Maybe I'll like it this time. I, haven't, I'm, I always have an open mind about games, so you never know. I went and replayed Nosferatu again after really hating that, and I actually liked it the second time I played it, so you, you never know. All right, so now at least I know not to keep walking to the right, right? Th okay. Is there a way to avoid these when they start falling, or is it just RNG? Is it... All right, so is it the same pattern every time or something different? That looks like it's... Okay, if we stay over here... Okay, so maybe you're safe on the very edges. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Alright, how do you get there? A rope, maybe? We have ropes, I've never even... Alright, now we... Ha the button to go through the door and use the inventory is the same button. That's a problem. What? I can't turn on my inventory. It goes through the door. I'm trying to move away from the door. Okay, here we go. That is horrible. I can't believe the game just did that. Maybe this is a maze? I get. I guess. I don't know where to go. Got a key. Okay, that's good. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> wow, I didn't even get a chance to move. I was dead in two seconds. Okay, let's try it again. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. Photon Earth, welcome in. AVGN covered this room. I've seen the AVGN episode on this, but it's been like probably like 10 years, so I don't like remember any of the details about it other than like he talked about the cutscenes. That's basically the only thing I remember from that. I'll watch it again after I finish this game, so I'll get a nice refresher course on it. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that for sure. I made sure not to watch it because I know it probably spoils a bunch of stuff. Good God. All right, let's try that one again. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. This is kind of fun trying to figure out the jankiness of this game. Look at the climbing animation. It's two frames of animation, her climbing up and down. All two frames. All right, we don't need to talk to Impa again. All right, so this is where the gators are going to be. There's fish here. Remember that there's fish here. I think it saves some. Yeah, it does save rupees, I think. Like, even if you die, you get to keep what you've got. All right, no more enemies here. All right, we have to go back through this again. Oh, I have to do all this again. All right. All right, get to the sides. We'll be fine. All right, go. The controls aren't the easiest with the jumping. Oh, oh my god, come on, dude. Really? 
<laughs> All right, now use a rope and we can get to the top and then we'll have to use the lantern to light up the room. Can you go in these other rooms? No, okay, well, I had to check. All right. All right, here's where the problem lies. You have to, there's just barely enough room to turn the lantern on in this room. For you guys that are wondering why that was a problem right there, the this is how you open your inventory screen. You have to press down and the like the X button on the controller. The only way to go through a door is also to press the X button. So if you're standing near a door, you can't open your inventory. You'll go through the door instead. It's extremely weird and hard to explain, but that's the best way I can do it, I think. All right. All right, it said something about reflecting. All right, so maybe we can use this. I don't want to go through the door. Switch to cloak. Okay. What do you do? <laughs> that didn't do anything. All right, maybe we don't have the right item yet. I don't know. It says reflect his attacks. All right, so that didn't reflect him. What other items do I have? I didn't try the flute. Didn't try the, okay, I'm gonna get back over there and try the glove and the flute, because I honestly don't know. Ridiculous. I have no idea what to do here. All right, at least those guys are easy to kill. I know how to get back there now every time. It's not, it's, the area is fairly short. I just have to do that tower every time. <laughs> All right, this is the first time I've been legitimately like stuck and on like not knowing exactly what to do. That's why Link is the hero usually. Yeah, but Link had to put up with a fairy screaming at him in a big empty field. He got really bored of that too, I'm sure. <laughs> but you're right, Link is usually able to uh, figure something out and not get completely stumped like poor Zelda. God damn it, it happened again. All right, got to be more patient. Be more patient, wait for the rocks, and then go. I'm, I'm such a patient person. All right. All right, go. All right, perfect. All right, back to the ropes. All right, this room is da yeah. See, this room's dangerous. You have to use the lantern. All right, now you can drop down to here. Now we go over here. Now I have to get the invent. Right, there were not birds spawning in this room earlier. Now there are. All right, switch items. Uh, power glove. Let's go. Okay. Uh, flute. I don't have anything that works in this fight at all. All right, we're gonna have to do something else because I have no idea what to do with that. Uh, where else can we go? <laughs> I'm just gonna abandon ship on that because I don't, oh, we can go, speaking of ship, we can go here. <laughs> I'm accomplishing nothing with that. All right, maybe we don't have the right item yet. I don't know. All right, we're gonna save the game. I'm, I'm kind of stumped right now on that one, but this is something new. All right. Oh, this dreadful place is too scary. An Arpagos nest looms at the top of the ship's lookout. Oh, crap. We know about that. Uh, Ogre Lady wants Arpagos feathers, I wrote down. She's in Hanyu Forest. All right. I think they're taking the captain's quarters key there. Hmm, there appears to be something in the nest as well. All right. So there's something to work on here. We can definitely do some things here for sure. There's also like a... There's also like a tower place that opened up earlier as well. All right, we haven't been there or we haven't been here, but I have a quest to get feathers, so let's try going here. I have no idea. You can't keep going. Look, you can't jump over that. That looks like that's like far in the distance back there anyway. You see what I'm looking at? See how the fence like moves forward like more towards the foreground but then goes all the way to the back? But Zelda is like walking in place here but doesn't go to the background. It's just, it's weird looking this game. It's hard to tell where you are. I know I've said that before. Shell of a hero, welcome in. How's it going today? Only thing I like about this game is the overworld map. <laughs> I think it's a pretty fun game, honestly. I'm enjoying figuring this out. 
Shell of a Hero, how's it going? The gameplay was made on drugs. Hey, I'm having some fun. <laughs> I'm having some fun. I'm not bored. If I was bored, I would be hating this, but I'm not bored. I don't know what I can stand on and what I can't. It's so ridiculous. All right, drop down. No. <laughs> Severin, what's up? Welcome in. Good to see you, sir. You're doing better than yesterday, Shell of a Hero? That's what I want to hear. That's good stuff. All right, stand right here. Wait for the gator. I'm going to stay on the gator this time. Okay, that's probably not a good idea either. All right, uh, I think if you go back to the map, it replenishes your lives. It does, okay. Well, that's really nice. All right, let's give it another try. Hopefully not into the water this time. All right, I'm gonna ride the gator over to the rocks and then we're gonna go across like that. All right, now we need to wait on the gator again. If I jump, it's gonna... But if you jump, it puts you back up. Okay, maybe you can just drop down to the gator from... This is just... This perspective doesn't make much sense. Like, if I jump, it puts me back up to where I don't want to be. All right, jump to here. How are you supposed to do this? <laughs> this is so dumb right here. I don't get it. All right, start over again. I do not understand this place, how to navigate it. You can't just jump over this fence right here. You can't do that. There's... An enemy with range attacks in the water. I see that. NES Zelda's a masterpiece, so I'll take that any day. I love that game. That's one of my favorites. Zelda 2 is my favorite Zelda game by far. But I love Zelda 1, and I love Link to the Past as well. And I'm liking this. So I found another Zelda game I like. How about that? Excuse me, game? <laughs> like, what do you want me to do here? Nothing is working. JP, welcome in. Monica, welcome in. How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are having a good day. <laughs> Thank you for the watch streak, Monica. I appreciate it. I don't know how to do this. It will excuse me, princess. I guess so. Mixed with like Zelda 2, that makes me happy. Zelda's Harry Taco, I love Zelda 2. That's probably my favorite NES game. If I had to narrow it down for NES games as my favorite, that would probably be at the top. That and Castlevania 3. Okay. How did I end up over here? All right, jump in the boat. Okay, can I do anything else here? At least, I don't know how I made it over here, but we did, so I should stop complaining and just keep going. All right, there are Stalfos here. That's what those are actually called, Stalfos. All right, those ghosts aren't too bad. I wonder if those are the same, if those are called Genies or whatever the ghost is in Zelda 1. But I love Zelda 2. For you guys that don't know, that's my definitely my favorite Zelda game. I've replayed it many times. We've done challenge runs. We did a no life magic, level one sword, level one life run, and it was hard as hell, but it was also a lot of fun as, as well. So yeah. And there's Zelda 2 ROM hacks as well, and I want to try some of them. That would be a lot of fun. The door is locked, okay? So where do we go now? Can I go in that hole? No. Can I climb the rope? Can I go in here? You can go in that! Oh my god, you can go in that tiny little door in the background. All right, so see, I'm trying, kind of ad adapting to what this game wants you to do. This ain't Ocarina of Time, I know, right? This is actually fun. This is actually fun. Can you believe it? <laughs> of course it's not Ocarina of Time. If it was, I'd be griping about how boring it was. Can we not get hit, please? All right, I guess you climb the mast of the ship. Okay, try it again. Can you grab these from jumping? Nope, doesn't look like you can do that. All right. I don't know how you're supposed to avoid those. Maybe if you leave the rupees on the screen, they won't respawn. All right, so you can just keep... Oh, key, yes! And Arpago's feather. Okay, we needed that. Where did we need that? 
uh, the Ogre Woman in Hanyu Forest. I have the quest written down. All right, so we can do that. And the key, I'm assuming, will unlock that door back down there in the ships. Okay, you know what? That's actually fine. <laughs> The captain of the ship was known to reflect quite often. You should see what resides in his quarters. Ooh. Oh, that's going to be the thing that we can kill the wizard guy with. Oh, my God. It's all coming together. How about that? This game is fun. It is, man. I don't get the hate for this game. Do you ever play Zelda Doom Mod? Yes, I will, Goobs. Absolutely. Because I, I saw Spade play it a while back, and I really enjoyed seeing that. So, yeah. Doom Zelda Mod is definitely on the table. I think it's a 3 T. I think it's a 3D Zelda 2 hack. I don't want that. Castlevania 3 at the top explain I'm intrigued. I love Castlevania 3. It's a very hard game, but there's a lot of replayability with all the different characters, the different paths. So yeah, Castlevania 3 is right up there at the top for me as well. I bought Zelda 2 right after it came out. Didn't like it at first with Grown Me and I feel it's a masterpiece. In Zomniac, I kind of the same way. I didn't like love it right away, but the more I played, I started like really getting into it and I loved it. Dragon King, how's it going? First on news today that Respawn is going to make a first-person shooter Mandalorian game. All right, well, I hope people enjoy that. I'll pass. I hate first-person shooters. <laughs> or modern ones, anyway. I love the very old-school ones, but, the, like, anything beyond that, I'm not touching. It's the most cursed Zelda game I've ever seen. Plural mold? It's not to me. You know what mine is? Ocarina of Time. That's the worst Zelda game I've ever played, and it's not even close. This game is a masterpiece compared to that. I will die on that hill. 100%. Plural, good to have you here. Welcome in. Oh, yes, we were here earlier. All right, good good stuff. Good explanation? Okay, yeah. If you want to know my, like, opinion on something, you want me to explain, like, why I like something or why I hate something, feel free to ask. I'll be glad to explain it. In fact, I... God damn it. All right, start this area over. All right, this place is a little bit hard to navigate. I got to, get, like, get used to where I can jump again. That's the way this game works. I will die on that hill, Studio Scott, just like you'll die on the hill that Sonic 3 sucks, right? See, we ha we all have our uh, reasons for hating what we hate. And I respect your opinion. <laughs> I completely respect it. I even respect people's opinion that like Ocarina. I don't understand it, but I respect it. <laughs> Lurking for a while, is this a, uh, is a good game? Yes, Sarvin, it is. It is a good game. I'm having fun. Princess Zelda, do you have any Arpagos feathers? I do. <laughs> Good. Then let us make a cape from your shroud. Here, I must be off. All right, Ogre Lady got us something. Okay, another cloak. All right, what does this do? Magic cape, magic cloak. Wait, that's that thing I can just throw at people, right? Oh, it's like a long jump. Oh, that's cool. Does that use any rupees? 228. 220. Okay, it costs rupees, but it's like a long jump. It does not work in the air. All right, it goes further than I can normally jump. All right, so that should actually be useful. All right, quit dying, how about? <laughs> All right, we got another upgrade. Healer, you're fine to have that opinion. I disagree with it, but you're fine to have that opinion. I, I love Blaster Master. Look! Look! Here's Blaster Master! Love it! It's right here! Love it! I've got it sitting on my desk. Phillips on the rights of these games? I have no idea. That's a good question, Dread Alien. I have not a clue. I'm assuming they probably... May, I, it's probably Nintendo. You know how protective Nintendo is with their crap, so I'm assuming it might be them. All right, so we turn in the Arpagos Feather. I'm going to put a check mark by that quest. We finished that. We finished the Spore. We finished that Fairy Dust. We have not finished the Heat Crystal to upgrade uh, something. That guy was talking about upgrading Sword. All right, so here uh, it said something about going in, uh, what? Uh, cat and the Captain was known to reflect. Okay, so maybe we're going to find another item in here. You do get a, like a, if you hit select here, it gives you a clue for the level, which is kind of neat. I like that. Do you know Sega made Blaster Master 2? Yeah, they did, but I've heard it's not good. I've never played it before, so I'm sure we'll stream it at some point. Because I'm very curious if it's good or not. Blaster Master is a great game. I think so. Oh, God! Back to the Gators! Good God, this Gator jumping part's awful. Maybe I can use that long jump move to, like, skip past these Gators so I don't have to put up with them. 
What don't you have on that desk? Uh, yeah, I, I bet uh, I've got Baxter Stockman also on the desk right here, if you're wondering. I bet you knew he was here. You just skip past the gators. What I'm gonna do this time is uh, we're gonna try that long jump move that I just learned. Maybe I can, I wonder if it'll work from over here. Let's try it. No, it doesn't. All right, I thought it would. I've never played Blaster Master 2. Maybe one day. I do have it, but I've never played it before. I hate this spot. All right, restart it. You get your lives back if you leave. Blaster Master 2 isn't good. Okay, so we're getting all kinds of opinions on that. Bang, have a good day. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you. Look good from a little bit I saw, but I don't know if I'd have to play it to judge it. Yeah, I've heard just people say it's bad, but I don't trust people's opinions on stuff until I actually try it myself. Because see, otherwise I would think Ocarina's a good game because everyone loves it but me, or at least most people. God, this part's so dumb! Great, all right, try again. I'm, I can't figure out where to stand. That, that's probably the biggest issue with this game is you don't know where you can stand and where you can't or where you can walk. So like, I, now I'm down here and now I'm over here. I'm here, there, and everywhere. It's insane. All right, uh, let's try the cloak. So maybe I can make it over there this time. Not even close. All right, we're, so we are gonna have to put up with gators. All right, gators and Miss 90s attitude characters, me too. Me too, everything's like boring and bland now. I don't think people hate this game. I think it's most of us have never played it and simply have heard it was bad. That's the thing, exactly. It was on AVGN, so most people just assume it's bad. But see, the thing with James was a lot of times not always hating on the games he reviewed. It was just a lot of times just for fun. But a lot of people were like, no, he, James said it was bad, so it sucks. It's not always that way. James has even said that before. He's like, yeah, th this game was kind of janky, but I kind of like it too. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have to take everything with a bit of a grain of salt and play it yourself before you make a true judgment on it. See, I gave Ocarina of Time a lot of chances back in the day and I hate it. So I have a reason to hate it. Okay, how did I get up there before? I guess we could use a rope maybe. All right, we do need rupees are useful because it like powers on my crap. All right, so I should be able to get over there from here. If I don't fall through the floor randomly. All right, can I go in the door now? I can. Oh my God, look what I, do you guys see what I'm looking at now? Reflecting shield. I knew it. I knew it. And so that all that time I was trying to fight the whiz robe guy, there was no actual way to kill him until you get this. All right, can I equip this now? Looks like it equipped automatically. Okay, good. And Impa said you explored this place to the best of your ability, dearie. All right, so we're done here. We're, now we can go to Shrine of Gamelon. Holy crap, is that the last place where we ever go? Oh, fact, the terrible hungry beast will make you his dinner if you're not careful. He guards some of his precious treasure on the island needed to vanquish Ganon. Wait for him to pucker up and give him a good slashing. I don't know if we're supposed to be there yet. Let's go back to the other place. Where the hell was the other place? Shoe Toy Lake. That's where the whiz robe was. All right, I think, right? Yeah, we're on the right track now. All right, good. Neff, welcome in. Happy to see Mixer playing something good for a change. Dude, I'm loving this. This is good. This is a good game. I'm, I'm glad you like it, too. You expected me to say that I hated it, didn't you? You expected me to say, you, Neff, this game's awful. Actually, I'm liking it quite a bit. I think it's fun. It's janky, charming fun. Does Impa say anything different? Neff, thanks for the seven watch streak. I appreciate it, man. A YouTuber called Brennel Floss did a funny song. How about I loved Link to the Past? I hated Ocarina. I was just shown that uh, like two days ago, JP. Sane showed it to me. And yes, it was a wonderfully oh fun video. It was awesome. Alma. I'm not afraid of you. Ha! Then wait here until you are. That's the guy we're supposed to be fighting. That's the guy we're supposed to be fighting. You run out of janky games mixer and you know we love it. No, there's a lot of garbage games to go. Many, 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 many. Let me catch up with you guys. I'm falling behind here. Think of them as the Florida Gators. They were the Florida Gators. They just sink and do nothing. Studio Scott. It wouldn't accomplish a thing. I like Ocarina of Time, but with Navi and Empty Fields could have been done better. See? Thank you, Chris. Thank you. See, it, it's, it's a simple, easy request 
to make the game better and they couldn't do it. AVG and craps on Sega CD, but I thought Sega CD was great. Yeah, see, Sega CD's got some good stuff too. That uh, Dracula game I played on it was jank at first and then I kind of liked it. And then uh, Final Fight on Sega CD was good. I like that. So yeah, Sega CD's got some good stuff. It's got good stuff. You want Mixer's opinion? This is it in a nutshell. 3D games equals trash. Not always. I found a few 3D. I play some 3D games occasionally off stream, but they're like turn based JRPGs. So I'm not sure if you could really count those. Not like a Dark Souls or like a Ocarina or anything. 2D games love. Yes. Yeah, shmups or Rage. Yes. I don't like Shmups for the most part. CDI Zelda games is good. Ocarina of Time is absolute garbage. There we go. Yep, that is my opinions in a nutshell. Bubsy 3D, I'm probably like that more knock arena as well. You'll just have to wait and see. I'm at, I am on the list to play it. So one day you, we will do Bubsy 3D here. Yes, we will do it. Will I like it? I don't know. I have an open mind. I always go into games hoping I'll like them. So yeah, maybe I'll like Bubsy 3D. I, it might end up being my favorite game of all time. You never know. I've seen it played. It doesn't exactly look good, but like I said, I haven't played it myself yet. So I can't make good judgment yet. And I haven't even played Dark Souls, and I like rag on that all the time, but I technically I can't because I've never played it. So that, that's not a fair comparison. It looks like it's something I wouldn't like, but then again, I might end up loving it. So just, I don't know yet. Turn the lantern on! Oh my god! I'm hitting buttons. All right, thank you, Zelda, for turning the lantern on. I appreciate it. All right, let's go. Ocarina pissed me off bad. I do have pure hatred for it. It, it was boring. I'd get stuck. The fairy was screaming at me. It was a miserable experience. This was awful. Uh, okay. These are the most ridiculous boss fights, like, ever. <laughs> so they're either impossible, or you just one-shot the boss based on, like, what item you have. I guess. I don't know. He's dead. <sighs> Alright, now what? Did we get what I needed? Wizrobe can only be beaten by his own spells. He's dead! Did I not get credit for killing him? How do you get out of here? All right, there was another door in there. In there. All right, maybe you have to use a rope to get up there. There's a door up top. Ridiculously fun. I, can, I like this. <laughs> can I go in here? I can. Oh, I blew one of these up earlier with bombs. Hold everything. Ah! Link told me about you. You know Link? Sure. He gave me his canteen for a kiss. You kissed him? Here, it's empty anyway. <laughs> Zelda's so jealous, it's insane! She's extremely jealous. I can tell right away. Oh my god, the drama. I want to see that cutscene again. Can we see it again? No, she's gone. Damn, I wanted to watch that again. Well, now we can go to Resong Palace, okay? Well! <laughs> Her face was so done with life. Cat Lady, welcome in. She, and she's done now. That other woman kissed Link. Zelda cannot handle this. She don't give a crap that Link cheated. <laughs> This is so funny. Me, Koppa, welcome in. How's it going today? I love how she refuses to answer the question. This is so awesome. How do people dislike this game? This is incredible. Me, Koppa, how's it going, dude? Good to see you. C. Geiger, welcome in. Cat Lady, hope you're doing wonderful. You kissed him! <laughs> this is great. Oh, I love this. This is just getting better. Oh, we can't do anything with that yet. Hold everything. This game is, like, awesome. <laughs> it's, it's getting better the more I play it. 
I kind of see where this is going to go at the end of the game. <laughs> Link did that in Crunchy. Link did that all the time in that janky Zelda cartoon. He was like, how about a kiss, princess? And she always told him no. It was like a running gag of the show. It was kind of funny. I liked it. All right, let's save the game now. I have no idea where to go. This is brand new territory now. All right, continue right along. All right, so where all can we go now? We can go to Resong Palace. We can't go to that tower yet. Can't go over there. Hanyu Forest. Have we done everything here? You've explored this place to the best of your ability. Okay, Hanyu Forest is complete. All right, what about Shutoi Lake? Explore this place to the best of your ability. So they, they actually tell you. That's really nice. Shrine of Gamelon. We haven't been there yet. Washubi Swamp. Is there anything else to do here? Nothing. So we're making very good progress. Is there anything to do here? Nothing. We are narrowing it down. Well, excuse me, princess. I mean, it's not like she knows Bagu, though. Yeah, Bagu's out there in the middle of nowhere in the forest. That's great. <laughs> Bagu. Oh, good old Zelda, too. I think most people just like this because AVGM made a video. You're exactly right, Neff. You are right. Zelda's Adventure. We got to play that, too. So I agree. These games are great. They are great. I'm, I'm having fun so far. Nobody hates the cutscenes as a reason they're on YouTube meme fodder. I've heard that there's a lot of memes based on those. I've seen a few in, a few here and there over the years. But as far as the, the gameplay in this is kind of jank, but I mean, i played way worse than this. And I was reading online, people were saying, this game's like the fifth worst all-time bullshit. People need to play more bad games. All right, we could go to Taikogi Tower, or we could go to Resong Palace, or we could go back to the Fairy Pool. Is there anything else to do here? No. Since I got a canteen or something. A canteen empty. All right, maybe I can, like, they tried to give me water of life earlier, but I couldn't take it. Let's try and get it now. I've got a canteen. I do have that written down. All right, I don't remember where those fairies were. Or, like, over here somewhere. All right, remember when we killed those witches here, like, 30 minutes ago. Oh, that's right. The fairies were, the fairies doing freaking twerking. Look at that. For you guys that weren't here earlier, this is what we were dealing with. It's nice to say confirm clear. I love that. I think that's really good. Can't wait for Mixer to play Zelda's Adventure. I have. We can definitely play it, Neff. We can play all the Zelda CDI games. There's the twerking fairies. New emote idea. I said that earlier, Lemon. And then I was like, you know what? I'll probably get in trouble for that. So maybe we shouldn't. Have some water of life. Can I, like, carry this with me now? Oh, I can! That works! See, canteen is full of water or life. Should I use that? Sh should I... Uh, maybe we shouldn't use that. Maybe we should, like, use the E-Tank Mega Man rules and not use water of life. Just like we're not going to use this cloak that, like, makes you invulnerable. Maybe we should add more challenges. No water of life, no magic cloak run. I just realized that's probably what we should do. Yeah. Hotel Mario. I've heard that's awful. Right, we could go to Resong Palace. Oh, what happened to the guest palace? There are invisible monsters everywhere. The front gate is locked, but maybe Duke Onkled has the key? I don't know. Oh, I'm getting hit. Invisible enemies? I don't think I'm supposed to... Yeah, I'm not... I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. <laughs> I think that's a little out of my league right now. Maybe we could go here. Taikogi Tower. Let's go here. Actually, I just should save the game first. Be, it's always good to be in the habit of saving often. Mario's Missing on DOS. No, I have no interest in playing Mario's Missing or Mario's Time Machine. I've heard that's like just a tedious, nonsense, garbage game that no one should ever play. Like, it's not, not even like charmingly janky, just it's like garbage. Oh my, it looks like everyone's been taken to Taikogi Tower. This is illegal, you know. My cakes will burn. <laughs> What the? Who are those people? The shit was that? <laughs> what? <laughs> what was that? Oh, I want to see it again. Why? It looks like everyone's been taken to Taikogi Tower. This is illegal, you know. My cakes will burn. <laughs> Oh my, it looks like everyone's been taken to Taikogi Tower. This is illegal, you know. My cakes will burn. 
<laughs> it, it makes no sense at all. None. Who are those people? Where are they? Why are they my cakes well burned. <laughs> This is getting better by the second. Frisky, welcome in. How's it going today, Frisky? This is illegal. What's illegal? What, what, what is he talking about? It's the best game ever. This game's getting better by the second. Uncle Nev, welcome in. Frisky, welcome in. I bad tasting games, nothing. This game's awesome, Frisky. You just don't know what's good. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred bits. I appreciate it. This is getting better by the second. I love it. I have good games for you, Dynamite, Heady on Sega Genesis. I've heard of that. I've heard that's pretty good here, Lurex. That's actually already on my list. Dialogue sometimes sounds like a bad trip. <laughs> my cakes will burn. What? Uh, I'm surprised that's not like a uh, like a sound command in somebody's like Twitch channel or something. I don't do sound commands here. People would be abusive with them, so we can't do that here. But I'm surprised like some channel hasn't put that up for like. Uh, channel points or something spend 500 channel points you hear the cakes will burn should we do that here no people would just spam it we could never do that is that there's an octorock up there i'm so hungry i could eat an octorock pearl thank you for the follow i appreciate it thank you so much it's great to have you here how was your super bowl sunday it was great ate a bunch of food i shouldn't eat like wings and like chicken wings with barbecue sauce and pizza and you know all that usual stuff that's good but you shouldn't eat it doing well not doing much to do at work so i'm chilling with you sounds good sounds good jaycox thank you for the 15 sir i'm sorry you're playing this game i pray for your soul so can't wait to bomb some dodongos i'm actually enjoying the game quite a bit i'm having fun <laughs> i think this game's fun it, it, like I, the the, the cutscenes are horribly awful, but they're funny. The gameplay is janky, but also kind of charming. So I think this is a good game. I know like so many people are gonna di disagree with me, but I, I'm having fun. Jaycox, thank you for the sub, dude. I really appreciate it, man. I hope you're having a great day. 15 months, by the way. It's crazy. Cutscenes in the game are just so random for like one to just put something in there. I'm glad they did. I like things that don't make any sense at all. All right, so I'm assuming we have to blow this rock up before we can go inside. It takes like 10 bombs or something. It's insane. Come on, hurry. It's awful. Mayor Cravendish has been chained in the tower. Oh, my cakes. Come see me in Sakado. Okay, all right. Well, Porky Pig's going to uh, talking about cakes again. So that look like freaking Porky Pig. <laughs> Does anybody else see that? <laughs> oh my cakes! <laughs> Best character I know, right? Oh my god, it's awful. What's he talking about, Ocarina? Yo yo, welcome in. How's it going today? Hope you're having a great day. <laughs> All right, I said something about seeing him in Sakato. I'm going to write that down. All right, so we're going to write in chef equals cakes in Sakato. So I'm assuming that's going to be another item or power up we're going to get at some point at some time. So I wrote it down. Link can have his cake. All right. Sakato is a real train station in Japan. I've been there actually. Really? Is that where they stole the name from? All right, so it's not an original name. They just stole it. Yo, yo, hope you're having a good day. This is freaking hilarious. You hate Beetlejuice or Ocarina of Time more? Uh, at least I was able to beat Beetlejuice in like one or two streams and it was done. Ocarina of Time I played on and off for like six months and I never finished it and I just hated it. So yeah, probably Ocarina of Time more. Fabled. What is going on, Mr. Fabled? How you doing today? Thank you for the good luck. I appreciate it. Things are going good. We're making some progress. I accidentally went outside the door. I'm trying to... Dude, I'm trying to switch invent. Okay, thank you. How big is the freaking door? Oh, the door's huge. That's the problem here, I see. All right. How did I die? These hands. Oh, these. I see these hands. I see. Okay. Well, that's nice. I thought that was part of the background. Silly me. Mr. Fable, I hope you're doing well got up it's 5 a.m. here you just got up wow <laughs> you're starting your day with a little um 
with a little uh, wand of gamble on. I keep forgetting the name of this game. Because there's like other Zelda CDI games. What's this say? All the Sakato townsfolk have been captured. Free poor Harbano, the baker, and Mayor Cravendish, dearie. And make sure to give that iron knuckle a good beating. All right, so the baker is Harbano. What a dumb name. All right. This is the best Zelda game. I like it. I don't have a problem with it. I think it's janky and fun. And anybody that thinks it's bad, they just watch the AVGN and they were like, oh, this game sucks because James hated it. No, it's not a good way to look at things. Play it yourself and then make the judgment. Don't just take someone else's word. Like I said, James uh, James does a lot of those videos just for fun, too. Right, those are not too difficult to kill. Those you are new. dare defy me? You will die. Guess again, Iron Knuckle. Get him, Zelda! <laughs> Get him! All right, maybe we need bombs. I don't think that's working. not doing anything all right uh more items uh that's not gonna do anything the g g glove let's try this he's dead let's get out of here <laughs> this gets better by the second. <laughs> oh my god, I love this game. I absolutely love this game. This is hilarious. This game is one gigantic meme. It was a beating heart in the armor, and Zelda just ate it and it gave her another heart. See, I've got five now. This game doesn't have bosses. Not really, Jorgle. It does not. Boss fights are epic. It's amazing, dude. It is amazing. It is so good. Family OG, welcome in. How's it going today? I see you popping in. This is wonderful. Take my Zelda 2 Iron Knuckle. Thank you very much. Yeah, the Zelda 2 Iron Knuckles are actually fun little fights to deal with, especially on that first playthrough. Throw cakes at him. Yeah, we got to go back to town. I forgot about that. I wrote down the we need to talk to the bakery. I said to meet him in Sakato. Oh, who is that? Freaking George Washington? This guy was in the cutscene a minute ago. Oh, the indignity. Please, your highness, would you kindly cut the chains that bind me? All right, we're going to save George. Ouch. Thank you, princess. I managed to conceal this magic lantern. I hope it can be of use. Well, we just rescued George Washington. All right. I can work with that. That was quick and easy. Electric Snow, what's going on, man? Welcome in. How you doing today? That's why you have to pay your help more. Exactly, Link. Exactly. These are, that was a joke of an iron knuckle ever. I know! It was George Washington! <laughs> we just rescued him, Goten. This is illegal! What was he talking about in that other cutscene? I don't even get it. Oh, we can go somewhere else now. Okay. All right, I wanted to see if we complete the... Why did this open from all the way across the map? That was weird. All right, let me go back over here to Taikogi Tower. You've explored everywhere. All right, we're done with this area completely. All right, that lets you know. All right, so Taikogi Tower is done. All right, let's find the baker because it said he, he said something about going back to Sakato. Let's look for him. He's got to be here somewhere. Heard this dialogue mix around so much that I can't take it seriously anymore. Man, just conceal this magic dick. I'm surprised, I'm surprised I haven't said that yet. I mean, anything is on the table with this game at this point, right? Oh my god, this, we found him. Alright, that was that locked door I had written down earlier for this place. Your friend Link could eat ten of these. <laughs> at least. Ha, the Arpagos will die for them. The hell are you talking about? Your friend Link could eat ten of these. <laughs> at least. Ha. The Arpagos will die for them. The Arpagos will die for them. <laughs> what? 
What? What? I mean, what's he trying to get me? A brick? <laughs> I thought he was supposed to. Oh, I have bread now. Okay, it looks like he's giving me a brick. Okay, well, how does this work? He just threw it on the. I did not want to. Can I not get it back? He just threw bread on the ground. Now bread's gone. Okay, can I get Your another one? Link could eat ten of these. Okay, I don't know what this is for. I'm assuming this is a quest item. Do I lose this if I use it? Let me find that out. Hold up. Believe that nice fish. Oh, okay, we, we still know about that. All right, so I don't have the bread in my inventory. All right, I'm assuming we're going to need Your this for something. Could eat ten of these. Right, shut up. I, I know. All right, bread is now in my inventory. Good. Good. We're done with this. I don't want to see that guy anymore. We're moving on. They didn't even talk about a cake! Hey, they were talking about bread now! What happened to the cakes? My cakes will burn! <laughs> Wait, what? Right, I guess we should buy some more supplies and stuff. <laughs> There's no cakes in there! It was nothing but freaking bread. Alright, moving right along. We're done with this now. Alright, so we have multiple places we can go now. We can go to... We did the fairy pool. Shrine of Gamelon. We haven't gone here yet. Or we could go to this cave, so I don't, I don't know where to go. I know I did not lose the bread, I got it back. He had too many cakes, sadly, only way to save him is to put him out of his misery. I'd kill him if I could, I don't like that guy. That guy's a, that, that's a questionable character, they move so much in the cutscenes. It's embarrassing looking. Twinkies, yeah, it kind of looks like Twinkies. I thought it was a brig, but yeah, Twinkies also works. Now it looks like the Monkey Island Merchant Store in the beginning. Yeah, Monkey Island's good uh, point click. I played that before. All right, we can go here now. What? What? Okay, there's enemies spawning immediately. This is Dordung Cave. All right, we haven't been here, and we have not been to... Okay, I'm going to write down these places that we haven't explored yet. That would be... Resong Palace had invisible enemies. So if we get, like, glasses or something, maybe I'll be able to see them. Go ahead and write that down now, just in case. Visible enemies, uh, Shrine of Gamelon. We haven't been there yet, so that's a possibility to explore. I wonder how long this game is. I have no idea. There's like a lot of places on the map that I haven't been to yet, so I don't know how deep into this we are, but I feel like we're making progress. All right, Door Dung's Cave is also available. The music's good, I know, yeah. What's he putting in those Twinkies? I don't want to know. We'll just move on. <laughs> we'll just hope we don't ever find out, right? All right, yeah, you can save the game. You know, as long as you're on the world map screen, Frisky, it lets you save anywhere. And when you run out of lives, it kicks you back to the map screen anyway. So lives are, like, somewhat important, I guess, but not, like, over-the-top important. They're more important in Zelda 2 than they are here for sure. All right, we got, I guess those are Dodongos. They, they do drop rupees. We should probably just kill them. And I have my... I have a range attack, so that makes things easier. Alright, well, there went my range attack. You don't get to keep that if you take a hit. You know what? And I just realized enemies do not drop hearts in this game. You cannot heal yourself. You just die. This is the first Zelda game I've ever seen where no enemies drop hearts to get health back. That's mighty strange. Okay, so where are we supposed to go here? Can I go down? I can go down there. It's hard to navigate in this game. Okay, this looks dangerous. Oh, uh, oh. Switch to the lantern! Oh my god, it's so hard to do that. Alright, I'm gonna switch the lantern out here. I have magic lantern now, so hopefully that's better. It's an upgrade. All right, there we go. Now we should be fine in here. Reese, Reese, uh, I wish they would have released these here on a regular console. For every season, welcome in. I agree. I agree, so that way more people could have gotten to play it. I think this is a fun game. I do not hate this game at all. Maddie, what's going on? Why don't you play that N64 game that people love? Because I, because this one's way better, Maddie. This one is way better. This is Wand of Gamelon. It makes Ocarina of Time look even worse. I'm enjoying this. I have not gotten bored a single time playing this game. 
Yeah, these enemies are horrible. <laughs> Maddie, thank you for the 19 months, man. But yes, I will not play that one that people love. I don't feel the magic of Navi screaming at me. Sorry. And you don't either. You know you, you don't like that game either. I know you. What, what do you do here? We're going to have to use ropes to climb. Maddie, thank you very much. See, I know. He hates it. <laughs> Maddie, you can't get away with that. I know you too well. Saw CDI and 3DOs as a kid at the store, couldn't get one though. I really wanted both as well. I'm kind of glad I didn't get either though, because I ended up getting a Neo Geo instead, which worked out pretty nicely. All right, this room's terrible. <laughs> Making no progress in this room. This game is awful to play. No, it's not. I'm having fun. This game is not awful to play. You want boring? Go to Hyrule Field. Plenty of things to do in this game. <laughs> You cannot hate it more than me, Maddie. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I hate it way more than you. I'm, I, I will die on that hill. I hate it way more. Dude, look at this dragon. Look at this puny-looking dragon. Is that supposed to be the Gliok from Zelda 1? Look how puny it is! Please tell us why you hate Ocarina of Time. Because there's a fairy that screams at you and there's hardly any combat. You're mostly just roaming around like a silly little errand boy. It's supposed to be the hero of time and the fairy's yelling at you and you're doing fetch quest. It's just boring beyond words. I hated it. <laughs> Heat crystal. Oh my god, we need that! We need that! We can go back to town! Oh, is that all there is to do there? That's all there is to do there. Unbelievable. That entire thing is complete. We can now go to Dodomai Palace. All right, this is new content as well. All right, Dorung Cave is completed. This is Do Dodo Ryan Palace. All right. I don't have a problem with the way this game plays. It's kind of janky, but it's fun. All right, Palace. Gliok was amazing in Zelda 1. That's a baby Gliok. Yeah, and Zelda just murdered it straight there on the spot. That was great. Mix hates Hyrule Field. He would lost his mind at Shadow of Colossus. Yeah, I, when things are, I would rather have a bad game than a boring game. Boring is the bottom of the barrel. I can't handle boring. Bad, I don't always like, but at least it keeps me entertained. Like, uh... Here's a good example. Beetlejuice on NES. I despise that game with every ounce of my being, but it was anything but boring. There was nothing boring about that game at all, and at least it did that. It, I never got bored. I may have hated the game, but it wasn't boring, and that's all I kind of ask for. Is Impa going to say anything different in here? She's going to talk about the Triforce. Do you see anything? Yes. Oh, my. Your father has been captured. What about Link? He's been in a terrible fight. I can't tell what happened. No new information there. Okay. No, make sure you look, kind of look like the King of Hyrule the more I look at it. I saw him earlier. I don't remember what he looks like. I seem... I don't think I'm going to agree with that. I don't... That guy I had was, like, big and, like, chunky with, like, a beard. I don't look anything like that. So where are you coming up with that situation. Okay, fight. I don't get it. Link is in traffic, clearly. Father's in trouble. Screw that. Tell me about Link. Hey, I know that other woman kissed Link and Zelda's like ridiculously angry. Rather be bored than angry? I'd rather be angry. <laughs> I can't be bored, man. Bored is the bottom of the barrel. Bad is better than boring? Yeah, I know. I can't handle it. That ought to do it. Works pretty good. Look, I got a new job. Look, I got a new job. Okay. Oh, now they tell me I've explored everything. Dude, I... Oh, my God. Do you know what I just got? My sword has a range attack now all the time. I don't have to be full health anymore. I just realized that. See, I'm hurt and I can still do my sword beams. So the sword got another... I wonder if this is like a temporary upgrade or if it's actually permanent. This seems way too good to be permanent. So I don't know. <laughs> I have... This almost seems like it's too, too good to be true as good as this is. This is insane. 
I don't know where we're supposed to go next, by the way. New job is flexing, I know, right? Don't you love that? Was Zelda angry? She looked nonchalant to me. <laughs> she was questioning about it. She was like, you kissed him? <laughs> she cared more about that than anything else. All right, I guess we could pick up some of these items here. I don't really spend rupees on anything. Impossible to get past level one on what game? Love the animation where he smashed his head on the apple. <laughs> and then he hands Link like a foam sword. That's what it looked like. Like, okay, here's your like foam sword, but it's a big upgrade. Dude, this game's beautiful. This, this is a fun game. I'm enjoying this. Where are we supposed to go now, by the way? I have no idea. So what's the last one we did? We did the cave, Dordrung Cave. We also have Shrine of Gamelon, Resong Castle, and Dodomai Palace. So that there's more things to do. Uh, can I see like those hidden enemies now in this other castle, which was Resong? Oh no, I don't want to leave. I want to see what's going on. Oh, what's happened to the guest palace? There are invisible monsters everywhere. The front gate is locked. Maybe Duke Onklid has the key. Well, I don't know. Is this going to help here? I don't know if I'm... I don't think you're supposed to... No, I'm getting killed. I don't think you're supposed to be in this place yet. All right, fairy pool is done. Okay, we could go here or we could go to... What's the other place? Shrine of Gamelon. Oh, Mag, the terrible beast will make you his dinner if you're not careful. We guard some of his precious treasure on the island. Need to vanquish Ganon. I don't know. That sounds like something you do later. That's talking about actually fighting Ganon. Where are you supposed to go here? This is new. Oh, new enemies here. Two spiders and stuff. Okay. All right. Well, this is where we're going to we're gonna try this place out. The other place is looking too questionable right now. If this doesn't work, we'll try somewhere else. I don't know. You don't heal from location to location. You do heal from location. You leave it, you get all your lives back. Like right now, I have five lives, five hearts. And if I lose a life here, I can just leave the screen right here and go back to the overall map and it'll replenish my health and all my lives. So that's kind of uh, forgiving. Oh, Impa's here. Look how your father was captured. You are my prisoner. Hey! Silence! Hectan, keep the runt in chains. Yes, master. Look how your father was captured. You are my prisoner. Hey! Silence! Hectan, keep the runt in chains. Yes, master. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to think that they weren't serious when they were making this game. There's, like, no way a company could have, like, seriously done that. That they weren't trying to be serious with this game. I'm sorry. No. <laughs> this, they were going for memes before memes were a thing, I think. Oh, what? Oh, my God. I don't know where to... All right. We got to turn the lantern on. What are you doing? Lantern. Oh, my... I don't know where to go here. Turn it on. <laughs> okay. Well, at least I know what to do now. The voice actors are paid with rupees. No, in this game, they're rubies. Frisky, they're not even rupees. Hey! <laughs> Alnonymous, welcome in. Black Anima, welcome in. Coco Mungo, what's going on? Broke as Fudge, welcome in. There was a game released with this style. I forgot the name of it, but somebody mentioned it earlier. Yes, you're right. That is a thing. I'd probably like it because I'm enjoying this one. Yeah, they're not rupees in this game. It's called rubies, you know, like an actual ruby. That's what they went with. All right, we're on the lantern. I know what to do now. Jump up here. See, there's a way to do everything. It's fine. Okay, is this a dead end? What was that? Oh, that thing can hit. Oh, I can hit that thing from there. Okay, never mind. I thought I was going to be stuck. All right, so do you have to get back in the water? Zelda can go through that grate somehow? Wait a... Okay, those are new enemies. We have all kinds of new stuff in here, but I have a range attack all the time now, which is overpowered. Dude, Zelda can go through this gate. How does she do that? The gate doesn't open or go down. She squeezes through those little squares. I don't know. I 
Hey, I killed him. Okay. Got a key. Uh, maybe a rope? Oh, the, I thought that was part of the background. Silly me. Okay, you can go that way, or you can go this way. All right. Oh, oh my God, it's a maze. Locked! Locked. All right, we got locked doors here. That's nice. All right, I'm assuming we can go in here. All right, this is the most complicated looking place yet. I'm, maybe I'll have to draw a map of this. Good. Good, I don't mind. And there's another key. All right, that should get us in one of those doors at least. All right, maybe we should kill those doors. You know what? Enemies are starting to drop keys and stuff. I'm going to start clearing out the enemies. I think that would be a good idea so I don't miss stuff. Get on the steps, please. Thank you. Dude, this new sword's, like, really good. <laughs> like, insanely good. Oh, I can't go past that. Well, then what's the purpose of that? Nothing. Chalk car, welcome in. This is not garbage. Excuse you, but this game is actually fun. I'm enjoying it. Love your shooting mixer. Gotta go. Sarvin, no problem, man. Thank you for hanging out. Have a good night, dude. Appreciate it very much. I will see you tomorrow or wherever. I honestly never played this one or Faces of Evil. It's kind of fun, Retro Fan. I'm liking it. Chalk card, this is good. This is not garbage. It's a fun game. Heck, 10 is dangerous. Ready? Am I here? Or here? Or here? <laughs> Next. Heck 10 is dangerous. Ready? Am I Okay. <laughs> okay, what was the point of that? Streamer enjoying a game like this makes it more fun to watch. I'm having a great time. I think this is great. <laughs> watch, I'm gonna like this a lot more than I'm gonna end up liking Ocarina. It's not even gonna be close. It's, there's no, no way it could be. This, this is, has a lot of fun charm to it. I, I, right, Dashi? That's me. That's me. <laughs> the point is Zelda 2. Beer Baron, what's going on? Welcome in. It, it's kind of similar to Zelda 2, which is why maybe I, why I'm liking it. But that's a, a good way to look at it. I don't know where we're supposed to go here. I guess we can go in the door now. Nope, locked. Locked! Oh, great! I got a key and can't do anything with the key. Better than Ocarina of Time? Oh, it's not even close, man. It's way better. Oh, that hit me. I didn't even... I thought that was part of the background. See, half the time I think these things are part of the background. Oh, no. Not another one of the rooms where stuff's falling. Oh, great. Oh, my God. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> I have more health this time. We should be able to make it. All right. Quickly. How do you go down? Okay, there we go. Alright, well there goes all my health. Hopefully we'll make it. <laughs> RUN! Made it! Okay, good. The game Ocarina of Time could have been, I know! Ocarina of Time could have been way better. Oh, was that the, the wizard guy from the, the cutscene? He's not taking any damage, alright. I can block his shots. No. Well, how do you hurt this guy? What has happened to Duke Onkled's palace? Hecton the wizard is imprisoned to brave Lord Kiro. He appears to work to a direct weak to a direct blow to the chest. You've killed me. Good. <laughs> that is the best cutscene I think I've ever seen in my life. I really wish I could see it again, but he's dead. <laughs> Holy absolute shit. Master Bismuth, constant reader, J Shoe Suit Man, welcome in. This is 
unbelievably good. <laughs> Dude, that was unbelievably good. Oh my god, you killed me. Good. That, like, I wish I could, like, I should have saved that scene where Zelda was, like, grinning right there after saying good. That was, like, the most trolliest looking grin I think I've ever seen in my life. I know, right? The smug look just sold it all. It was so good. Crudus, thank you for the hug. <laughs> this game is just beautiful. Oh, I was thinking about something serious, but that's ruined now. Oh, it's completely ruined now. <laughs> I was as good as it gets. All right, now we found this guy. Was this guy in the earlier cutscene? Duke Unclid betrayed the king. I know. Strike the head of the portrait to enter Unclid's chamber. Thanks. Strike the head of the portrait to enter Unclid's chamber. Hold up, hold up. That sounds important. Strike head of portrait. Oh my, I cannot believe the Duke betrayed Hyrule like this. You heard Lord Kiro go to a room with a large painting next to the door and strike it to receive the key to Onkled's chambers. Okay, so we gotta look around the castle more, apparently. I wonder if I've already seen that, but have, like, just didn't know what it was. I don't know, like, we gotta look around. Maybe be able to download that from somewhere. That's so good. That actually could, like, be a redemption on my channel. I don't have like sound redemptions and stuff, but that one might be worth putting in there. It was really that, it was good. You met someone said, I cannot help you yet? Nope. Nope, but we're finding people that are saying you killed me and then Zelda says good. <laughs> that is the best thing ever. <laughs> this game is quickly rising up my list of favorite first playthroughs. It's that good. That, oh gosh, okay. Can I kill that? I can. How many people has Zelda murdered? A lot. Oh, there's a portrait on the wall. Oh my god! That's it! Okay, that's it. It's gonna be a boss fight. What the hell is he doing? D don't hurt me, Zelda. I'll tell you the secret way into Resong Palace. You better talk fast. Go all the way left and move the rock. This key opens the gate. I'll make sure he doesn't get away. <laughs> you better talk fast. <laughs> Zelda's gonna murder that guy too. Man, Zelda's a Zelda's bloodthirsty in this game. This woman can you don't mess with this woman. You don't do it. Now we can go to Nokani Forest, alright. Well this is new. You killed me. Good. All right. Nokani Forest is a new area. Uh, did we finish everything that was to finish in this place? You've explored this place to the best of your ability. All right, we're done with Dodo My Palace. So that's done. All right, so we struck the head of the portrait. Nokani Forest is the next area we can possibly go to. Or we could go to Resong Palace. I don't know. Since this just opened up, I'm assuming maybe we could go there. We still have to go on the one trying to gamble on. So there's still three places to work with on the map. We're looking for CDI YouTube poop all the time after this. Yeah, I can look at the memes and stuff now. I was trying to avoid anything related to this game after I played it the first time. Zelda wax people in this game. I know, she she murdered that wizard guy. That was the best thing ever. Starting to believe Ganon is a good guy at this point. I wouldn't doubt it. Mentally numb, I know. This is who I want to play as from now on in every future Zelda game. Is I want to play as this version of Princess Zelda. This is as good as it possibly can get. All right, what are we doing here? Saving the game first, because I don't want to lose my progress. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and save it in like slot two as well, just in case. If there's no harm in being careful here. But yeah, Zelda's as bloodthirsty as HG. I'm going to tell her you said that, Frisky. I'm going to tell her you said that. She's not going to appreciate that. What the hell is that? Speaking of which, I believe these are gorillas. I think they're throwing boomerangs. I think we found gorillas. Grumble, grumble. 
Grumble, grumble. Where's the, uh, when's the, oh, I bet the bread will work on them. I bet that's what we'll do. Use the bread. <laughs> There's gonna be one that grumbles and we're gonna feed him the bread. I I'm seeing this coming a mile away. You better be scared, Frisky. Pretty good for CDI, but good luck getting it. What, top-down Zelda CDI? You play Zelda and it has acting and all? There might be a, like a PC remake of it that I could play of it. I'm sure. Because that's what this one is. This one you can download for PC. Goten uh, pinned it to the top, so if you want to download this, you can go get it. And I recommend this. Everybody should do a stream of this. So if you're a streamer, don't watch me. Don't get spoiled. You need to play this completely blind. All right, so you can go inside the tree trunk here. That's good. All right, so uh, I believe I saw Myra the forest fairy climbing in the treetop here. You should see what she's up to. Okay. So there's my clue. That's what we're working with. Magic lantern. We can use that. Now I... There's flying eyes and crap in here. So that's a new enemy. I haven't seen those yet. Gorillas are in here. That's new enemies. I have a very overpowered weapon now. It's got a permanent range attack. Grumble, grumble. Hey, she is here. Not. She's probably working. <laughs> if she hasn't played this game, this would be a good playthrough. Murder them all. I'm trying, Beer Baron. It's a very murderous Zelda. Way more powerful than Link. Link's a freaking weakling. This Zelda's awesome. Can't go that way. It's hard to know what you can jump on and what you can't with this game. That's one of the hardest things to figure out with it. What the hell is that? Oh, it's this ogre woman again. This light will penetrate the dark around Ganon, but only the wand can defeat him. Good luck! Smug looking Zelda takes the lantern. Is that an upgrade? Matt Fairy Lantern now. It is an upgrade. Okay. Uh, you explored this place to the best of your ability. Okay, so what was the name of this place? Nokani Forest has completed. We are done with Nokani Forest. You know, the story makes sense, so you can't follow it anyways. The story makes no sense at all, and that's probably the best part about it, is how ridiculous it is. <laughs> it is insanely ridiculous. All right, save the game. We got something from there. Continue on. Resong Palace, that's... Maybe that's where Ganon is? Because I said something about the, sh the wand here. Omak, terrible as a hungry beast, make you his dinner if you're not careful. He guards the most precious treasure on the island, needed to vanquish Ganon. Wait for him to pucker up. Give him a good slashing. Okay, so maybe this is where the wand of Gamelon is. They were talking about oh that a minute dear. ago. Omfak is guarding the shrine. Whatever I see, I shall devour. <laughs> Mm. Oh dear. Dude, how do you get rid of all this crap? Just more stuff oh, pop. Dear. Impa, get out of the way! <laughs> I think I better like restart the screen. <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> all right, let's keep going before all that crap piles up again. <laughs> It's like Donkey Kong, I know, right? All right, you can jump over the barrels. All right, there's gonna be a giant monkey up here throwing all this crap. All right, these do some damage. All right, so just jump over them. All right, that's easy. All right, I took a couple of hits there, it's fine. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> Trash taste? Dude, this is so much better than Ocarina, it's not even close. Give me a freaking break, dude. I'm actually having fun with this. Ocarina's just a boring pile of shit. This is actually fun. <laughs> I'm enjoying the hell out of this. It's, it's corny and janky as it is. It's fun. It's fun. That's all I wanted was fun, and I'm getting it here. I'm getting exactly what I wanted. Ocarina, I'd just be complaining about how bored I was walking across Hyrule Field for the 85th time. All right, can I do anything with this 
ominous looking painting in the background. Doesn't look like it. And do anything with this? Oh shit! I exited. God oh, damn it! I exited by accident. There's an exit in the end of the. God damn it! Now we have to do this again. Why do, you know what that should spawn once you kill the boss? Why is that like there what during the boss fight? I don't know That is ludicrous. All right. Well, I guess we'll just have to do the barrels again. That's fine. Oh Look how easy I that time I did the barrels hitless see easy <laughs> If I play breath of the wild or tears of the kingdom no I have not. I have not played any 3D Zelda games besides Ocarina, and I hated that with a burning, bloody passion. So it, like, it scared me off from ever trying any other uh, 3D Zeldas again. But, but see, here's the thing. I've seen like how the other 3D Zeldas play, and they like they do everything that Ocarina didn't. So I would probably like them a lot more. I'm taking a lot of damage. Okay, at least we made it to the top. That did not go very well. All right, so what do we do here? That did not work. All right, let's try again. Maybe I need a different item. Let's try the power glove. Why not? Maybe that's what we use. Got him. <laughs> this is getting better. It's so good. Random JP, welcome in. Boop, welcome in. Oh my god. Got him. All right. We got the wand of Gamelon. Holy crap. All right. Got him. <laughs> got him. All right, I got Wand of Gamelon. Can we use this? We can. I bet this is going to be a good weapon, right? This is going to be a good weapon. I wonder, that's probably costing rupees. Hold up. I got 297. Okay, so it doesn't cost any rupees to use that. Fascinating. Okay. <laughs> There's blood everywhere in this room, too. That's amazing. Blink and you miss it. The bosses in this are a complete joke. All right, I guess we can go here now. There's nowhere else I don't think in the world to go. We've been, we haven't been to this ship yet, or this like lighthouse down here. We haven't done any of that. Right, is there anything else to do in there before I move on? Hold up. Shrine of Gamelon. You explored everywhere. All right, so we're done with that. Uh. So, I guess this is the last place to go. You are ready to face Ganon and rescue your father, dear. I'm so proud of you. The Triforce of Wisdom mentions that a well of hope holds a key to Ganon as well as falling. Good luck. All right. All right. Now I can see the enemies here. All right, so see, I was here way too earlier. Way too, uh, I was here earlier and there was like no reason to be here. Yeah, we got the Wand of Gamble on the Wand of D's. D's what? D's nuts! <laughs> it's like Mixer's almost done. Oh, I don't know. I don't... Is, can you fall there? No, you can walk across that. Okay. <laughs> I was about to say what the hell is that. Dr. Hell, welcome in. How's it going today? Thank you for the good luck. Things are going really well here. We're making progress. Apparently, we're getting close to Ganon. It's too dark to see Ganon, but the Triforce says you can only win by falling. I wonder what that means. Well, I don't trust the Triforce because, like, earlier in the game, Impel was like, Oh, the king took the Triforce of Courage. There won't be a problem. And then the king went missing, and then they sent Link in, and then Link went missing. So I don't trust this Triforce bullshit. It's not doing anything useful. You can go anywhere over there. I'm doing good, Dr. Hell. I hope you are too, man. I'm liking this game a lot. I think it's fun. 
It's fun jank, basically. It's not, of course, it's not a high quality game, high production value or anything like that, but it's fun. And that's all I ask for in a game is just be freaking fun. Don't be boring. That's the main thing with a video game. Just don't be boring and everything will be fine. I can't go in that little gate up there. Okay. I'll watch out for that falling stuff. All right, there's a boulder in the way. We know how to deal with this. So you throw bombs at it. And that's how you get in the door, okay. And, oh no, oh gosh, I probably should not have done that, okay. All right, uh, you can't switch the lantern because the, the gate's there, so you have to switch the lantern first, then go in the door, because the same, the same button goes in and out. Good God, they can hit me from down here, that's awful. Oh, I can hit them too, okay, no problem, we're good. Arrange mirrors to unify the country. Hook between who? Ganon and uh, Zelda? Imp is too old. <laughs> where is Ganon? I want to know. I wonder what... I, there was a cutscene earlier where Ganon was in it. What is that? A little bitty head of Dracula? Can I not kill this? Apparently you cannot kill... Oh my god, there goes the light. Are these not kill- Dude, these are not killable. Maybe you need the power glove, I don't know. Don't go back through the door! Good God, you hit the X button, it goes through the- Going through- And you have to press down and the other button to get the inventory screen up. The controls in this are just insanely bad. All right, does the wand of Gamelon do anything? It looks like it's useless. It's not accomplishing a thing. All right, I don't know if these are even killable. See, I like killing all the enemies in the room because sometimes you get a key from doing that. Uh, try this. Wow, okay, well this place is frustrating. <laughs> that didn't exactly go well. I have a medicine I can use, but I'm not gonna use it because I've, I've decided to make the game a lot harder than it needs to be. So we're not using the medicine or the magic cloak, which makes you invincible. So yeah, we've added some challenges to the run just because I decided to in the middle of it. How goes the best game ever? Incredible, Rydia. You missed some incredibly awesome cutscenes. Zelda killed some wizard, and the wizard was like, you killed me! And Zelda goes, good! And that was the end of the cutscene. It was amazing. And then we found, fought some monster that turned into a bunch of chicken wings or something, and it died. And uh, Zelda goes, "Got him!" And that was the end of the cutscene. It was so good. I wish you'd been here to see it. <laughs> it was amazingly good. <laughs> This, this game keeps getting better. All right, we're back in this room. We're fighting. These are gorillas, I believe, because they're throwing boomerangs. I'm pretty sure. Got him. All right, got him. Right? Yeah. All right. So we got this place is hard. The enemies in here are more dangerous. Okay, so I don't know how to kill these. The power glove didn't work. Don't go back through the door. The controls on this is so bad. Uh. Power Glove didn't do anything. Magic Cloak, I don't know. Maybe you just can't kill these, I don't know. Can I kill them at close range? The lights are off! Switch back. God, this room's terrible, okay. Maybe you can't kill these. And the light's back on. Door is locked and beautiful. All right, well, how do I deal with that? Maybe you're supposed to kill these guys and get a key? Like well, CDI Zelda, there's a game that came out recently on scene called RZ Jewel of Faramore. Yeah, somebody was talking about that earlier. Maybe I would like that. These are not killable. Maybe, oh, let's try bombs. Hold up, I do have other items. Everything. Okay, well, at least I know where the key is now. <laughs> that was awesome. All right, switch to bombs. You have to keep switching stuff in this game. All right. 
That guy respawns endlessly. Alright, so maybe just you need to kill the other one? Well, this sucks. <laughs> Got him! Is a flying man's face shooting planes is way less cool. Transformer heads from Holy Diver. It, yeah, I, exactly, right? I like how you put a Holy Diver reference in there. Doesn't like the Zelda games we know and love? I know, Jax. It's a lot better, is it not? It's much better. <laughs> Thank you for clipping that. Link, those are going to show up in a montage one day. I like them so much. I'm going to put them in part of my rage montage because those are just too good. Those are just too freaking good. So those are going to show up one day. I need to get to work on making more of those because they're just freaking awesome. <laughs> this is a screen that defeats Mixer. The Frisky? Frisky, what am I going to do with you, sir? You know what? You're going to play me in Street Fighter. That's what you're going to do, Frisky. That's what you're going to do, right? Or are you just scared? Oh, that's right. You're just too scared to do that, I bet. You won't fight me. You'll just talk crap from the shadows, won't you? That's all you'll do. What time is it, by the way? It's almost 4 o'clock. You know, if we finish this, we're going to try a challenge run or something. we we'll try a fun challenge run. Does anybody have any idea what it is? Wolfmaster and Rydia might know what it is. <laughs> what if I did it on the first try? That's going to be the best part. Dude, this place is hard. Zelda Con Sliders with crazy legs. All two frames of animation, Jax. Good should be a command. It probably should be. I agree. I'll, I'll make it one so we can look at that clip more. Cypher staff only one CC. No life already knows. No life already knows. My grave is ready. I may not succeed with it today. One day. One day. What if I did it today? What would you do if I did it today? No life. Well done, man. <laughs> what if I did it today? You got to do something if I do it today, Wolf. Riddy has got to do something too. What if I did it? You guys think it's impossible, don't you? What if I do it? <laughs> it's going to happen. Do it day you have to forever accept the fact that you're a god. That's not good enough. No, you have to do something. And no, we're not talking about me. We're talking about you. Not good enough. Do it today. I'm uninstalling you from the internet. No! You have to do something. Like... You have to do it too if I do it today. <laughs> You've already suffered enough. You're just getting warmed up. You haven't played Holy Diver yet. <laughs> want to try Castlevania with the Power Glove suit? I want to see it, no life. You've already done uh, freaking Bill and Ted. Castlevania would be a lot harder, I would think, because Bill and Ted's more of like an exploration adventure. Castlevania would be insane. Oh, we're, this is somewhere new. We made it somewhere new. All right, progress. There's a door up there. That's clearly where we're supposed to be. Assuming you have to jump over that get locked. Son of a bitch. All right, so we need the key. We need to find a key. That's fine. Oh, like, there's like a... This is where you hang people right there. Right? That's what that looks like. I can't believe that made it into a Nintendo game. That's shocking. All right, can't go into any of these. Nope. What about that well down there? Can we drop down there into that hole? Looks like a hole down there. Here's your cheating if I'm here, no breaking character. Beer Baron, you'll be wrong again. As usual, when you're like, oh, Mix is gonna die, he's gonna suffer. No, he's in, no. When does that ever happen? Oh, you can drop into the well, okay. Well, at least we know where we're going now. What am I gonna land on? <laughs> okay, I got worried there for a second. Can I go through this grate? A lot of times you, you can... Jeez, okay. Oh, that's a trap! That's a one-way trap! This is back in the beginning! Oh my god! Oh, that's terrible. This is all the way back at the beginning. How are you supposed to know? You're not supposed to know. You're supposed to fall into the trap. I don't have any lives now either, so I just might as well just kill myself and start over. I'm not going to make it now. I have no lives. Just start over. God damn it. Because uh, Beer Baron, at the end of the day, all the suffering's worth it because I usually end up getting through whatever we're working on. And I'm dead. Okay, good. 
<laughs> you killed me, good. All right, back to uh, saving the game and working on whatever this is. This place is difficult. Definitely harder than anything we've seen so far. You got a lollipop for me? All right, thanks, Frisky. I, I was gonna say, you, you, you can play Street Fighter with me, but I guess a lollipop will work. Map song dance, the map song's good, Ready? I'm gonna look it up like after the stream's over and listen to it again. That's gonna be awesome. Wouldn't have this problem if you stopped sucking. Well, you know what? I play games like this. I'm not just a little Dark Souls fanboy. So yeah, I actually like explore games like this that you were like, yeah, this game's bad. My name is K-Fight. All I like is Dark Souls. That's all I, I like 3D. <laughs> I don't give games like this a chance. <laughs> what Street Fighter do you play with me? Alpha 3? Alpha 3 or Super Turbo? You Street Fighter 2, Super Turbo, or Alpha 3? The only good Street Fighter games. Not that jank-ass one that everyone else likes. All right, let's... Uh not get hit here because I could really use all the health I could get my hands on because this place is like somewhat difficult. All right, I wonder if we have to get the key again. No, that guy stayed dead. Oh my god, he's still dead. That's actually amazing. And we're back to the courtyard. All right, so now I know where to go. <laughs> he started it, goobs! <laughs> I'm defending myself. If, if you don't start trouble, there won't be any. I will defend myself here on stream. You can't just abuse me and get away with it. I hit back. <laughs> All right, can we, like, how are you supposed to do this? All right, maybe there's time to, like, wait. <laughs> All right, get, now go. All right, no time. All right, now? Well, I made it. That's all that matters. All right, we're dealing with gorillas again. Hungry gorillas. Yep, grumble, grumble. All right, uh, ropes. You can use those to climb up. Yep. You don't know what a hard game is until you play Dark Souls. Maddie, if I had a dollar for every time I heard that, I'd be a rich person right now. Oh, there's a key in this room! Oh my god, we need the key. We need that key. I hope I have enough health to get it. There's stuff that... I wonder if the falling is random or... or... All right, got the key. If I die here, I wonder if it'll let me keep this key. Okay, so now I can... Oh gosh, I'm gonna get hit, yep. Okay, now I can go in that door that was locked because we got the key, but here's the problem. I'm gonna run out of lives, and I don't know if it's gonna save me with the key. That could be a problem. If I have to do this whole place like every time, that's a huge problem because you take a lot of damage in here. And I made this a no water of life, no magic cloak run. Because the magic cloak actually makes you invincible for a while. And I decided not to use it, which might be a mistake now. All right, that's the door that was locked a minute ago. Should be able to get in there now because we got a key. Bring light to my lair? You must die! No! <laughs> I didn't get a chance! I didn't know what was gonna happen! <laughs> Alright, well, rip! I guess we'll go again. You killed me. Good. I, I didn't expect we were going to find Ganon there. Well, he's right there. I wonder if I have to get the key again. Uh, if you're going to challenge, make sure to find a game be something we both have experience in. One must fall. I wish we could play that, Goobs. I don't think you can play that online or unless they come out with like a new version of it, but I would love to play it because that game is wonderful and like hardly anyone's played it. Johnson, thank you for the five watch streak 19 minutes ago. I'm sorry I missed that. I don't know what was going on. So sad you have to beat scrubs like me to feel good. Frisky, I would destroy you. <laughs> Not been playing fighting games for a while, so I suck again. That's, they're hard games to stay in on, right? How about we play Marvel versus Capcom? No. No. 
I, I'm too old to learn a new fighting game. You know that. Way too old. I'm like about to turn 43. That's too old to learn a new fighting game. I will continue with what I have. Why do I need a new one? I loved old Street Fighter 2, Super Turbo, and Alpha. Why do I need anything else? Because it's newer that makes it better, am I right? Newer is always better. Because <laughs> it's new, it's better. <laughs> Get with the program. No, and never. Not on your life or the next. One fit, let me keep the key. Hopefully we don't have to do all this again. Because this place is difficult. Kill him. All right, there. See, I don't even need the lantern to get through this room now. I know exactly where I'm supposed to be. Maybe I do need it. <laughs> Only one year older than you? Well, you're too old to learn a new fighting game, too. Damn it. All right, I, we need, like, lives for Ganon, because he, he might be the only boss fight in the game that's hard, because he killed me really quickly last time. All right, we're almost back. We're about to find out if I need to go get that key again. Super Tilt Brothers when it releases. What is, is that a new, uh, is that like a platform fighter type game? Was that going to be like another Smash? There's, there is a Smash game that's coming out like called Multiverse where you can play as like Superman and characters. I saw something like that. Oh good, I can go right back to Ganon. Oh my god, that's good. You must die. What a What, he looks like a frog. All right, oh, I didn't... All right, so uh, they said something about needing the Wand of Gamelon for this fight. All right, so it's that button. Ah, the chains! No! You haven't seen the last of me! One hit! Good God! <laughs> Koala from Walla Walla, welcome in. If you have the right item for the bosses in this game, they all die in one hit. One hit. No matter what, no matter what boss they are, Ganon, doesn't matter, that wizard guy, uh, that thing that turned into a chicken, it's all one hit, no matter what boss it is, no matter what. I was thinking maybe Ganon was going to be different. Father! You've saved me! Here's the traitor, your majesty. Please, your omnipotence, have mercy. After you've scrubbed all the floors in Hyrule, then we can talk about mercy. Take him away. Yes, my liege. I wonder what happened to Link. Oh, he was a four anyway. Stop looking at yourself. What happened? <laughs> Nothing, Link. We were just about to have a feast. Great! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell kind of ending was that? What in the absolute hell kind of ending was that? Are we disappointed? No. <laughs> Oh my god, that was unbelievable. That was actually unbelievable. I am in awe. Simaltic, welcome in. Kid Zero, what's going on? I'm blown away. That is the kind of ridiculous ending this game deserves. Jax, I'm anything but disappointed. I'm thrilled. The, the dumber it is, the better. <laughs> At this point, I'm just all in on dumb. <laughs> Nothing, Link. We were about to have a feast. Uh, what? Why? <laughs> oh, my God. Thank you for the GGs, guys. This was unbelievably hilarious, this game. And it was also a lot of fun. And now guess what? Guess what? Now you get to hear it straight up. Now I've done a full playthrough of this game. I think uh, I think this game is way better than Ocarina. It's not even close. Takashi's Challenge, I've, I've heard of that. I've heard of that one.
<laughs> you have unlocked hero mode. This difficult mode available under new game causes enemies to do double damage and makes a canteen unavailable. Perhaps you should beat the game again in hero mode to see what happens. Oh my god, loop two, dude! Holy absolute shit, they're giving me a loop two! Now I really love this game. I love it. I absolutely love it. Loop, we're not gonna do it right now. Not right now, but in the future, yes, we will be doing loop two. That is absolutely awesome. That is incredible. I didn't even use the canteen anyway. Good, I don't want it. I don't need it. That's as good as it gets, dude. I could not ask for more. I am blown away by this incredible, amazing game. Not only was it full of fun memes, not only was it really janky and kind of fun to work through and play, but now you're giving me a loop too? Yeah, I would, Wolfmaster, excuse you. Literally the first person I've ever seen become overjoyed to see there's a loop too in this game. Glad you found this to your liking. Mixer, best Zelda, best Zelda, Zelda 2. So uh, my order of Zelda games now that I have played would be Zelda 2 number one, uh, Link to the Past number two, Zelda one number three, the Wand of Gamelon, number four, and in nine billion, nine trillion place would be Ocarina of Time. So yeah, that uh, that's my uh, Zelda ranking so far of the ones I have played. Now, of course, I could play uh, Link's Awakening or something like that, and I would enjoy that. I've seen it.